Greetings and hallucinations, ladies and lads. I am Chancellor of the Harmonious Frequencies of the Mighty Empire of Onion, and this is Oxygen Not Included. I always have to be careful because for some reason I want to call it One Hour, One Light, One, one Life. That's what it was. Oni. Instead of Ohalt. I get it confused, and it's been... A long time since I played any O-Halt. We're starting to fill this up with polluted water, and that's not good. Pinch of pepper seed. Warm sweater is in here still. Why didn't anybody get this before? I don't know. I think we didn't have any place to store it, right? Because I hadn't really discovered it yet. Where'd all this water come from? Did some ice melt out of an ice maker or something? Uh, let's deconstruct this, actually. I don't know if setting that to a six means that they'll... deconstruct that first or not. We'll do it like this, though, for now. Then we're still using this to collect water, but I want us to be putting water into this uh, container as often as possible. This reservoir. So we are going to swap that over. Hang on. How tall is the thing first? Right there. Okay. Do we want it like this or like, like that? We'll put it there. I was about to deconstruct this, but we have to have it to access this still. This could be deconstructed, though. Whenever they get around to it. So how are we doing? We have the light bugs floating around everywhere. That's really good. I'm very pleased. We don't have any in the main room yet. So we're waiting for a max of four critters to bring in. We've got some in the farm, which is great. I've got them set to four critters, so they can light up these lights here. What's this? Body temperature. Is it too hot? No, it's 85. It's not getting above 86. Oh, now it is. Now it's down again. Yeah, the water is coming out of the fans, maybe. But no, it shouldn't be running down here. I don't know where... It's got to be coming out of this, right? Oh, they're still sweeping stuff out of the... Out of the tank here. The sweep tool isn't set to a higher priority, is it? No. Okay. So they'll just get to this stuff whenever. Oh, we should excavate this. So that oxide, oxalite will uh, do its thing. I don't know if that'll have the hydrogen escaping or not. It doesn't. So that's good. I'm pretty pleased with our plumbing, but we're gonna, soon we're gonna need a way to process the polluted water uh, so it doesn't overflow. I say soon, like it's going to fill up right now, but uh, it'll fill up soon enough. Four. So we could also do worse than to drop a couple of these here. We may even need one there. And dig this out. I think what I would prefer to do, though, is to tile it in. So that it's kind of double walled. I may want to do that all the way down here, too. What were we uh, using igneous rock for the insulated stuff, wasn't it? Because it doesn't heat up as as quickly. Okay, yeah. They're growing a little bit, and there's still water everywhere. Poor Joshua is sleeping in water for some reason. Where is it coming from? Does this thing spill out water? Ha! 
because it's definitely spilling. I really don't know. We could also go ahead and dig this uh, algae all up. What is this, granite? They could still make it to the airlock by doing that. We could. We could tile this in too, I guess. But I feel like uh, we'll want to go further with the ladder. Get that out of there right now. Okay, that one's good. They haven't built this one yet. They haven't deconstructed that yet. finish mopping these things. How are we doing on food? We've got 129,000 calories, so it's going up now. Building in two minutes. Oh. Yeah, some sand fell down from above the algae that we that we cleared. That's not super important right now, because we don't have any polluted water just laying around at the moment, thankfully. I feel like we might need a dupe just for cleaning things up. We may not have any storage space, though, also. Yeah, here's a couple of these guys. We might need a separate ranching room for them. For a drop-off, we've got little baby ones. We've got shine bugs. Glum. Okay, now he's groomed and happy. We have 134 gristle berries in here. I think I was trying to um, to kick out the phosphorite so we could have more room. I think that's why this guy's on the ground. Yeah, we do we do actually have quite a lot of storage still. We'll add some more. Downtime, long commutes, forty percent. Yeah, having the rancher live over on this side of the base wouldn't be a bad idea. I just don't know what good are the hatches, right? Stone hatchling, sage hatchling, eats dirt, eats sedimentary rock. Yeah, so they eat everything. And then they excrete coal. So it's not a bad thing to have them around. So I wonder if it would be a terrible idea to uh, to get these guys. There's eggs in here. Now oh, we researched something. Good. Filtration technology. Gas filter, liquid filter. Good. And we got the algae distiller, ethanol distiller, and water sieve. Wonderful. What does that mean? Liquid filter? Okay. Gas filter there. Refinement, we've got the water sieve. Produces clean water from polluted water using sand. Produces polluted dirt. Okay. Algae distiller refines slime into algae. We'll be needing that soon. Ethanol refines lumber into ethanol. We haven't encountered lumber yet. I assume that it's on the surface. Way up, way up top. So eventually we'll get there, but it's not now. Is this a vacuum? Okay. I'd prefer it be that than... Just straight carbon dioxide that'll flow down and interfere with our perfect balance. Perfect balance. Um, so, germs, right? Slime lung germs are all in here. I was thinking about trying to go for this because we're, we're nearly there already. But I feel like we need suits. How far away are we from suits in our research tree? This time I actually meant to zoom out, believe it or not. Crazy, right? Uh, I think it's down towards the bottom, right? Liquid gases, exosuits. 
So we need ventilation, we need textile production, which I think this requires, uh, yeah, the loom requires the plants that are in the slime biome anyway. What is this? Oh, monuments? Great monuments? Must be built to achieve the colonize imperative? Wow. And a midsection and a base? That's incredible. So there's, yeah, the three pieces. That's, that's wild. Jet suit dock. So this exosuit overlay. Atmo suit pattern. Fabrication of Atmo suits at the exosuit forge. Forges protective exosuits for duplicates to wear. Prevents gas and liquid loss in space, I see. That's a put in the background, I think. Atmo suit checkpoint. But I just want, uh, like, hazmat suit. Is that the same thing? Atmo suit dock? I think it is, you know? I think it is. HVAC thermoregulator. Cools the gas pipe through it, but outputs heat in its immediate vicinity. Carries gas allowing extreme temperature change exchange with the surrounding environment. That would be kind of nice. Liquid tuning, advanced caffeination, espresso machine. Nice. Nice. Increases morale. So improved ventilation. We get insulated gas pipes. Minimal change in temperature. Gas shutoff, high pressure gas vent. Oxygen mask checkpoint marks a threshold where duplicates must put on or take off an oxygen mask. But oxygen masks aren't going to stop us from getting uh, diseased, right? Let's see. Oxygen uh, mask. There. Ensures my duplicates can breathe easy for a little while. Okay. So that... Okay. Atmo suit. Ensures my duplicates can breathe easy anytime, anywhere. I think that's what we're going to rush. We'll rush Atmo suits. And we'll see how it goes. We have a bunch of raw food, it seems like. Unrefrigerated. Gristleberries are here. Uh, yeah, I have I have several things set to be cooked, uh, but we don't have what we need to cook it then. Meal lies zero, even though we've been growing meal lies in here. I guess I have been growing a lot of bristle berries though too. Okay, what uh, duplicates do we have available? Germ resistant, uh, increased decor. Decorating errands. Sculpt or paint to improve colony decor. Why does it say uncultured if, the, if she has the bonuses? Increase medicine. Supplying is plus eight. Suit wearing plus two. Increase construction and creativity. Why do we get so many creative types here? Increase athletics. Requires light to sleep. Cannot do digging. Binge eater. Decrease bathroom use speed. She's a vomiter, though. I'm not fond of that. Increased husbandry. So he would be, with the suit wearing, would be a little bit better. Requires light to sleep, so we could just have a, uh, a light bug delivered to his room every now and then. Increased athletics. Or we could just put a light in his room. That's another possibility. Hmm. We'll think about it. Shine Nymph times one. We've got plenty now. We're breeding them. We just had one hatch out. Uh, let's see if we can build the room for the rancher over here. And then we'll give... Or right here would be fine, right? That's why I put this room here, isn't it? Let's see. Let's make some insulated tile out of some igneous rock. One, two, three, four. On the inside. That'll be fine. And then we'll just put a regular old pneumatic door right there. A 
apricot right there. So let's see, who lives here? Bubbles? So she's the cook. She just runs, uh, like, straight out and down, and she's in her station, right? So her com commute isn't that far. Turner, Nisbet, let's see, Rowan, Travaldo. Who is my Wrangler? It was Rowan, wasn't it? I think. Skills. Yeah, Rowan is the Wrangler. Oh, Nisbet has, has jobs. Improved carrying for a supply. Yeah, she should be my supply person. Improved carrying, too. Exosuit training could be next. We'll see. She can also do medicine, which is good. A medicine level 1 would be kind of nice. Uh, Joshua, what are you up to? You've got a bunch of good stuff going for you right now. Uh, you're about at the top of your game, though. I don't really want to improve anything else. Yeah, same with him. trivaldo has got two skills. But he's at the top of his um, morale level. Morale need. He's got full doctoring. So that's good. You could do electrical engineering too as well. Just in case. Nobody's really needed doctoring yet. So that's good. I guess we could do with another builder too. Uh, what do we have, like, huge excesses of? Total? I can't sort it by by total. Available. Eggshells? Zero units? What else compostable do we have? Because it says we have 2,152 units. But it's zero of eggshell. Okay. Whatever. 89 tea, dirt and clay. Filtration mediums, medicines. We have one more curative tablet, so I might need to make a few more of those. Metal, algae, eggshells. Oh, polluted dirt. We could put that in here for the these little scamps to eat. Is this almost full of polluted dirt? No. Storing sandstone. Should be just polluted dirt and rot pile, right? Oh, the storage bin is made of sandstone. Yeah, 21,052, so all of the polluted dirt is in here. We don't have any rot piles yet, so that's good. Yeah, obsidian. So the most... The item that we have the most of is the polluted dirt. So that's fine. Uh, let's look at the germ overlay. None. Okay. Then I'd kind of like to dig this out. And we'll turn this into a little hatch room. Right, we'll catch these two guys and deliver them into here. Let's go ahead and get uh, this built. So we can get a new dupe in. And uh, I wanted to see temperature overlay. Yeah, it's kind of warm over here. It's kind of warm in here, too. I was hoping having this fan at this end would help cool things off through the whole place, but... It's not exactly working that way. I'd do the six for... Oh. Why, w why did it just do the walls, I wonder? I don't know. Here, we'll do that, though. Hopefully they'll get it done. I'd also like this done, but uh, we're not doing too bad on water. And see, there's no water being spilt right now. Like, where did... Seriously, where did that come from? There's a hatchet lives over here, too. I'll bet he's eating all of the stuff that was over here. It's mostly sandstone, it seems like. Which I would rather he wasn't eating it, but... Still. Yeah, these things. Thimble reeds. I think we need those for... Uh, for crafting clothes and stuff. Oh, look. A glossy Draco. What do you do? Glossy Dracos are non-hostile, graze only on live mealwood plants. Their backsides are covered in bioplastic scales, only grow in hydrogen climates. So he's not even in hydrogen right now, though. This is hydrogen. And there's mirth leaves down here, so this man is happy. 
pinch of pepper seeds. More security doors and computer desks. Oh, okay. View entry. We would like to remind staff not to use the CC, all function for intra-office issues. In the event of disputes or disruptive work behavior within the facility, please speak to HR directly. Thank you for your restraint. Director, everything went well. Roussard was reluctant at first, but she has little alternative given the nature of her work and recent turn of events. She can begin at your convenience, XOXO, Dr. Jones. Oh, no. XOXO? What are they even like? Yeah, so we could get to some thimble weeds up here, but it's very hot. 131 degrees. I wonder if an Atmo suit will protect them from that kind of temperature or not. I'd also kind of prefer for the water to all run down here, so I probably ought to close this off and then put a door down here so that we can, like, open it when we need to, maybe. Maybe that's the play. Yeah, just pulling that off in there. It's working, kind of. It's all gotten very warm in this in this base, though. I'd love to move these machines like down here somewhere. So we, I would like to have this hurry to be. Uh, gotten rid of. I guess I made a mistake by not piping the water from here into the toilets, because it's using water from in here now, I think. I know. Because that's the way it's piped. So I wonder if taking that up... Not taking it apart, but what if I could plumb this into into the clean water side? Because if we were building a pump, all I would really have to do is bridge it, like, right here. And we could pipe, pipe it straight in. But to do that, I would need to make this uh, tile on both sides. For it to stay. So you know what I think? I think we're just going to do this. We might lose a little bit of uh, water into here, but I don't really care. We can maybe try to filter filter pump it out. We just put a pump down here and uh, have a filter. As you do, you know. I guess I should have uh, tiled this in before we started dumping polluted water in here, too. It wouldn't hurt anything for it to drip down here, I guess, but... It would kind of be better if it wasn't doing that. Uh, what's this? Completed, or carpeted tile. Used to build the walls and floors of rooms. Increases decor, contributing to morale. Okay. Fiber, 2,000 grams. Okay. Alright, so you belong to Rowan now. Assigned. And we could call in a new duplicate. I was thinking about this guy, right? Building, decorating, and suit wearing. Requires light. Cannot dig. You should be okay. We have enough diggers, I think. Valdo, why are you sleeping on the floor? I think he was narcoleptic. Okay. He doesn't have a, uh, a place to eat yet, but we'll end up putting that, like, maybe over here or over here near enough to this place so that he can grab his food and then come over here and eat. We'll move these eventually. Uh, so yeah. Let's drop. I don't know why there's two on this side. Okay, built. Come on, we're leaking polluted air. Construction should be up here. Okay, thank you. Okay, it's done. 
Oh, come on, guys. Well, I wanted this emptied, I guess. Yeah, we read those. Discovered textile, so the loom and the carpeted tile. Okay. Insulated gas pipe, Atmos sensor, gas shutoff, high pressure gas vent. Good. All good things. Okay. So now let's go for another liquid pump. Uh, we'll do this at a six in here. Do we want it right there? I mean, I think so. Because I'm, I'm going to try to put another one down here uh, to pump out the good water. Okay. This has gotten overcomplicated already. Uh, you can go here. Yeah. We're going to need a bridge. Uh, I'll put it here. Mm -hmm. And then for the pipe, we'll come out in and across. Okay. And then we could do a liquid valve uh, right here. To turn that off. Well, we can't because it, it won't allow me to. Uh, but that's okay. Here we can just... Um, can we not just turn this off plainly? Disable building. Halt the use of this building. Yeah, do that. Switch it. And then in plumbing, we'll go for another uh, liquid pump right here. Okay, and we'll put, uh, we need a liquid filter, let's see, running this direction, something like here, well, even down here would be fine, but up here would be better, okay. And we'll take the liquid pipe and go up to here. We'll come out. Yeah, for now. And then we'll come out here and put a vent right there. Okay. That's all on a six, it looks like. So that should get built. Yeah, we got the, that done. Okay. And I would kind of like to get some more insulated tile around the bottom here. Yeah, because this is starting to cool down, which is great. This is crazy hot, though, so I need to move almost all of this stuff way down. Like, down below here somewhere. So we definitely need to start getting this piped out already. Has this already been turned off, I wonder? No. So that's okay. Until we get this stuff built, I don't, don't need it turned off just now. I wonder if our new guy has skills yet. Ruby. Ruby Tuesdays. Construction. Oh, here's suit wearing over here. So yeah, supplying is one that we would need to work on to get him over there. So that'll be your first, first one. Big guy. That needs to be swept up. That's it. Muck root. Do we just not know the recipes for those yet? Unrefrigerated, fresh. Are those not being supplied to this 
critter feeder. I'm not sure. I feel like it's not. Oh, here we go. Okay. Uh, yeah. Wrangle him. Also wrangle him. This says max two critters, shine bugs, and shine nymphs. Look, we're gonna move you guys. Uh, what, what was the thing? Stations? No. It was... Wasn't furniture either. Food. Will they die like, die like that? I don't know. They're trying to get loose. That's for sure. Uh, yeah. Which? Who's that? Ruby? Nisbet Ruby. Okay. We need to put a, uh, a light in here. This is going to make it easier to run a wire. It's the nearest one. I feel like running it along the ladder is going to be better than inside the wall. Because the ladder already ruins decor. Yeah, I need to get some decorations inside these rooms. Sculpting block would be good. What does crown molding do? Oh, along the ceilings? Okay. But I think uh, portraits take up like a 2x2 two two space, so I was kind of saving, saving area for that. I don't know, maybe plant pots or something could go in there. How are we looking on temperature over here? It's livable right in front of the fan, but like it's still up in the 90s up around here, which is pretty harsh. We could uh, deconstruct these. Two tiles. And then bring this this roof down one. And double up on the insulation up here. But then it would be offset from this too. Frustrating. Yeah. Cancel. Cancel building these for now. What have we got so far? Okay, yeah, these these uh, both pumps need power. Uh, this filter needs to know what it's outputting. Liquid output all. Output two should be should be liquid, right? Polluted water. Yeah. So the polluted water will just always flow through, and anything that's not polluted water. Uh, we'll go up and out. Which it makes me wonder now if I should have put this up higher, because it seems like all of the regular water is up here. Uh, but anyway. Let's see a wire. Um, sure. That'll do for now. And then we'll switch this off, and uh, these these two will be building like crazy. It'll be wonderful. Yeah, those are already at sixes. Okay. Get them built, boys and girls. Oh, I'm paused. That's why. That's why they're not doing anything. We're out of food to cook already. It's a tragedy. Do we need a second uh, greenhouse already? Oh. Uh, critters, hatches, hatchlings. Yes, and and don't let them out either. Uh, wrangle them. 
Wrangle him too. And this thing can hold uh, hatch eggs as well. Yeah. Is he going to deliver them right away? Yeah, he does. Good, good, good. Nice. I like it that they can reach that storage from, uh, from inside without opening the door. There. There's your buddy, Hatch. Stay in there. You're welcome to eat this granite and stuff. The igneous rock too, I guess. Uh, but really, I would love it if you would eat the, um, the polluted dirt out of here. Yeah, we kicked it out. It's on the ground right here, behind him. There, he ate some already. Nope. Did he just pick up all the polluted dirt and put it back in there? Okay, that's fine. Okay, so now we have uh, exosuit overlay, Atmos suit pattern and all that. Cool. Uh, this is the doctor's office. Maybe we should start clearing this out for a new room. We've got a couple of spaces, though, already that we could use. I just don't know. We need to work on the water stuff first and get this all built and done. Yeah, yucky lungs. So we're going to need some more curative tablets. We'll get six of those going. Oh, it's a little bit left. Okay, and this has been turned off as well. Good. Oh, this needs power too? Why the heck didn't I know that? Six. Okay. Is the water cool? It is kind of cool over here. That's good. Pipe blocked. Uh, right. But this shouldn't be pumping anymore. Yeah. It's emptying out. So we're just very... We're only very slowly using water as we go. Food poisoning germs. to wash up pretty good though oh wow a bunch of germs over here that I didn't realize I think I must have known that from before but I just didn't think about it We are getting meal lice out there. It's just really slow. How many dupes do we have? There's a way to tell, right? Eight? We've got eight dudes already? And we only have six chairs? So I need to make another... another place for them to eat over here. Skills. You thought I was getting a new dupe, didn't you? I don't think I can upgrade anybody right now. He could get upgraded, but what would we even do? Improve farming three? Or two, sorry. Crop tending, farming. I mean, right now he's my super hard digger. Ruby, you ought to be something already, right? You're supposed to be supplying. Yeah, Nisbet also supplies, so that's good. What's our athletics? Three. His is seven. Joshua, how'd you get so good at athletics? 
probably from tidying. I think he's been around for a while too. Yeah, Bubbles is seven. I think uh, they actually got that from running the electri electricity things, these manual generators. I think we'll leave it for now. I don't think they're hungry at the minute. Now, does this try to flow down? What's that? Oh, regular dirt? No, it doesn't. In fact, it kind of flows up. And these guys are growing now, too. Yeah, 84 point... Yeah, 85. So they're barely cool enough to grow. Okay. Um, yeah. Disable disinfect of these. Okay. That one's already been disabled. Okay. And disable disinfect of that too. Do they disinfect the pipes? Yeah, it seems like they do. Can I... Can I disable disinfecting of buildings? Or is this just to manually do it, I guess? Okay. Doesn't matter. Yeah. So there is clean water that's going up through here then. That's good. Oh, yeah, because we dug down a little bit. So that's why. It's in the clean water territory now. Let's actually cancel this this build to be done until after it sucked the water out. Uh, nah, let's not dig it down anymore because it'll it'll sink down too far. I think. It just requires a mess table for a mess hall, huh? So I might... No industrial machinery? Do these count as industrial machinery, I would think? Maybe. Do they put... Output heat? Any oxygen? Doesn't really say. Didn't we have the thing that cools... High pressure, gas shutoff. There was something that cools the uh, the air, right? Not the fan. There's drywall. Atmos sensor. Atmos suit dock. Checkpoint. Exosuit forge. Textile loom. Refined metal. 200 grams? How do we get refined metal? Can we fabricate refined metal? With the fabricator? I still don't have any workable orders. Oh, you know what we could look at? Refined metal. What? Refined carbon, refined renovations? It says refined metal. Why is this still here, too? Oh, okay. Elements? Geezers? Solids. Aluminum? Aluminum ore. So it's got to be that. Right, copper? Additional states liquid? At almost 2,000 degrees? Copper is a conductive metal suitable for building power systems. Reinforced type refined metal. Or resource type, sorry. Melting point 1982. So is there a smelter or something? Heat capacity. Thermal conductivity. Uh, where would that be at? Decor. Liquids. Solid material. Brute force refinement. Rock crusher and kiln. Okay, clay into ceramics. Smelting. Refined metals from metal ores. So we need to get there. 
Temp shift plates, accelerates or buffers uh, heat dispersal based on the construction material used. Fire pole, rapid duplicate descent. Stores any solid materials delivered to it by duplicates. Stores the solid materials of your choosing. Auto sweeper, automates sweeping and supplying errands by sucking up all nearby debris. Conveyor overlay, wow. Okay. That's too much for me. I'm not there yet. Everybody's working so hard, but I'm still not getting jobs done that I want done. It's crazy. Here, we need to turn this off until this uh, clean water gets pumped out. Good job. But then this will be the next one we turn on. Yeah. Wait, why is there clean water that's going down right here? Oh, this is this is broken. Why is that broken? Yeah. Get that built, please. What the heck? There's a wire there missing too. Oh, that's for this pump, though, so that's not as important. We'll just put that as a five. For now. You'll still sweep in this stuff over here? Fine. See if I care. Oh, yeah. Rock Crusher and Kiln. What does a rock crusher do? Refinement. Rock crusher. Inefficiently produces refined materials from raw resources. And the kiln fires clay to produce ceramics. Okay. Where are we getting polluted dirt from now? You know? Why? What could you possibly need in there? Is she making... What is she making out of the... Making omelet out of um, a hatch egg or something? Yeah, this is producing heat also. It's pretty hot around here. We really need to move this stuff down. How are we doing? Pumping water out? Not very quickly. I think we might need another greenhouse higher up. Because we're, we're low on foods too, aren't we? We're running... We're getting lower all the time. Achievement unlocked, turn of the century. Turn of the century? Have we gone 100 days? Yeah, cycle 100. With at least one living duplicate? Oh no. <laughs> Power produced spikes right here. Crazy. Calorie generation is all over the place. Oxygen produce is kind of, kind of wild. Power wasted? Ouch. Painful. Travel times? Not terrible. The work time is going down though, which I don't love. Stress created is going up. Domesticated critters is is going up and down. Four. Who died? Oh, the one in here is dead. Is this hydrogen up in here? Up in here? 
Where'd that come from? <laughs> Get him. How come we can't wrangle these guys? Can we not uh, capture? Cannot wrangle. Cannot wrangle. Huh. That's crazy. Is it because they're too high up? Like, can we can we capture them? No. Cannot wrangle. Okay. Whatever you say, bud. Oh, I had ideas. I wanted to get uh, some chlorine. I wanted to get some chlorine around an exit area where we abandon our suits, you know? So that it'll kind of clean our suits while we're gone. Maybe it goes over here. Or up here, rather. Because I'd love to... I'd love to open this up down here, right? So if we deconstructed this and then dug this out like this. Boom. And then we did us uh, a ladder up this way. Boom. And then we could open this up. Uh, but I wouldn't want to do that until we have uh, some tiles built. Because I don't care if this fills up with water, but I kind of want it to come down here and meet up with the with the pool in this area. I don't know why they prioritize that job when we've got so much other stuff to do. Only regular water, please. And we'll keep that as a six, so they'll go ahead and empty out waters. Somebody's gonna get trapped in here soon. You just watch. Just watch and wait. And watch. And see. I'd also like to go ahead and uh, dig out this algae while we're here. How are you doing? Yeah, it's still pumping out. Pumping out the water. Yeah, the gross stuff's getting spit out over here. We're getting mostly clean water. It's getting fed to the plants and everything. These guys are too hot. 89 degrees now. Why is it so hot down here, though? I'm not sure. I am tempted to do this, though. Then we could... Can we deconstruct this ladder? I guess we could. It's kind of a... Kind of odd, though. Yeah, they can go through this critter area to get there, so it's okay. I still don't know what I'm going to build over here. Yeah, this is almost empty, even though we're pulling most of our water from down here. Is this creating regular oxygen? No, carbon dioxide, water. Okay. Oh, let me know if the music is still too loud. It seems loud in my ears, but... Oh, why didn't I think of this? I guess I knew it was going to happen from one perspective, but I wasn't sure. Wait, we have no place to store anything? Oh. We have way too much stuff, I'm telling you right now. And these are all outside of the dang colony as well. They have to leave the airlock to even get to these is a little crazy, I guess. It's still breathable up here, and it's getting denser all the time, every time they exit.
Yeah, see, like, if we got... If we got a suit system going, like, over in this area to deal with this slime and stuff, that would be great. We could get this gold amalgam, the thimble reed, and, you know, all the slime and clay and stuff out of here. We could have the refinery outside and have chlorine gas, like, cleaning up all the germs off of it all the time. And we would have to use an Atmo suit to get in there or whatever. Hmm. I'll think about it, though. Okay. I would like for all of this stuff to get swept up, though. I'm tempted to uh, to fill this back in all the way up to here so that we don't lose this bit of water but I guess that's a little bit greedy because this cool steam vent will give us all the water that we could possibly need right maybe oh there's a hatch back here too well he can live here that's fine I like the sound effect for that shower. Very accurate. How long does this guy have to live? 25 of 25. It dies today. Do we have any other eggs around? Like, we're not using... We're not using eggs for this, right? Raw egg forever? Yeah, stop... Stop using eggs for that, because I thought... I thought I told her not to do that, because we were trying to store the... Shine bug eggs. These guys have a ways to live, right? Come on. Let me click on you, dang it. No. 13? Okay, maybe this one will lay an egg before it dies. Because I don't want to run out again. I don't get why I can't pick what kind of eggs she's using. It only allows me to choose yes or no. Dust cap. Where do we find mushrooms? Mush. Dust cap. Uh, dark areas, ill suited to the cultivation of plants. Place of typical chlorophyll. It's fitted with thousands of specialized gills, draws in carbon dioxide and aid in its growth. And aid in its growth. Okay. Fungal sport. Dust caps produce mushrooms, fungal growths that can be harvested for food. Life cycle, 7.5. Darkness, temperature, 41 to 95. 150 G minimum. Carbon dioxide. And it requires slime. 4,000 grams a cycle. Farm plot. Okay. Alright. Okay. 9 of 16 crops. Oh yeah. They're too hot. They're too hot down here. They got too hot down here. So water all your plants. Hydroponic farm. There we go. And then we'll go for another uh, farm station. Right there. Okay. I guess we could put a uh, airflow tile up here, though. Where do we reckon, like there? Easy enough. Uh, we could just come down here. 
and over here with that. Polluted dirt is out here. Why? Probably because I didn't uh, reactivate this to put it in here. I think they can reach that through the door. They were doing it earlier. Well, we may add a couple of, of plots over here, too. Am I building all of this stuff out of igneous rock right now? Or, or did we get the igneous rock back from breaking down these tiles? Okay. They have to be made from copper. That's a shame. We have a bit of it right now, but we're going to need a lot more later. We might need to expand the lavatory, too, if we have eight dudes already. What's the maximum dimensions of a uh, washroom? 64. That's 4 by 16. So it could come back to here. That only allows us two more machines. I'd want like one more toilet and one more sink. And we can leave it at just one shower. But then this uh, would have to be moved. Which nobody's using this anyway because nobody comes back here. I still don't know why we can't trap these guys. 16 of 25. 16 of 25. So hopefully they will lay eggs as well. Because this one's the only one alive uh, that's um, captured right now. Still just not sure why we can't wrangle these guys. It doesn't make any sense to me. Okay. Yeah, they cleaned all this stuff up. That's good. They don't love being in the, the water, though. That's for sure. I think it just came down here to get algae to take it somewhere. Maybe to the oxygen dif diffusers? Pleasant chit-chats. We're definitely not a well-oiled machine, but we're not in terrible shape right now. We still have long commutes. Cycle 103 report is ready. Fire pole, temp shift, plate, metal refinery, metal tile. Okay. It's like the metal refinery. Again, I would love to have it down low so that we could, uh, could work on that. I'm a little worried about this chlorine escaping, but I guess I shouldn't be because it's not very terrible. It's a very small amount. It would dissipate through, like, the whole colony. And probably come up here. So it shouldn't be a problem. But we need to expand. The hydrogen might be a bit of a pain. Of course, I could always just close off this airflow tile and move these somewhere else. Close this whole area off. And then, um... And then dig into it. So we wouldn't release the gas into the... Into the place. It's like, I think these guys kind of like carbon dioxide anyways. Yeah. Oxygen, polluted oxygen, and carbon dioxide. No, 
Okay, so these just need to be planted now. Uh, I guess mealwood seed. We'll plant them all for now. And then, uh, once we get the thimble... Thimble... Why is that wire there? That's weird. Trivaldo just passed out. Sopping wet. Smelled flowers? Oh, good. Wonderful. I don't see any cool uh, coal that these guys have pooped out. None. No pooped coal. Only on... They only graze on live mealwood plants? These guys do? Uh, it also says pinch of pepper plant, balm lily, and mealwood. So whatever. Thick woolly fibers. There we go. So if we were able to shear these guys. Huh. Woolly fibers. Hydrogen. Hydrogen climates. Huh. There are some living down here too. In fact, there's a bunch everywhere. Okay. Do we have eggs anywhere? Terrible meal. <laughs> Wow, Joshua, do you really take that long to eat? He didn't care about the meal quite as much. He didn't care if it was terrible. Why aren't they laying eggs? Please lay eggs. Oh, that's right. Dang it. Why am I not smarter? We can lure in airborne critters with, uh, with phosphorite. Somebody open the door. Okay, yeah. They're captured. We got them. Yes, they laid an egg. I think that's what happened. Is there an egg behind him? Grooming station. No, it's not an egg. It's just very shiny there. Okay. You can see there's gristle berries in here, so he should have plenty to eat. He's glum for some reason. Glum, tame. A soft light. Yeah, so hopefully these guys will reproduce. I don't understand why they why they stopped laying eggs. Because we had a whole bunch in here before. 1825. Happy, groomed. Maybe they didn't stop laying eggs, though. Maybe we were just turning them into omelets. Because I had it set up that way. Oh, like a ninny. Oh, yeah. Okay. I think they can do both of those. Oh, 
Oh, that's a dust cap right there. Okay. Polluted oxygen, though. I don't really want that up there. There's a little bit of germs over here. This is polluted water, isn't it? Yeah. So before I broke into there, I would want to drop it down a little bit. Two, three, four, five. So if I wanted this all walled up, uh, we'd have to have a, a spot there that we could get to. Okay, and I would actually want no. I don't want a door right here. That'll be fine. That'll be fine. Okay, yeah. He's still pumping out uh, the clean water out of the bad water pit. That's good. Yeah. All the water flow is correct right now. So that's very good. What is this guy doing again? Carbon skimmer? I don't even see that much carbon dioxide, honestly, right now. So I feel like we could disable this, too. I feel like that was kind of unnecessary to have that running. That'll reduce our water usage a little bit, but it should be okay, I guess. She's sick. Oh, yeah. Sopping wet, hungry. What else was wrong with her? Stamina. Decor. High morale. Soggy feet, low oxygen, cold air, sopping wet. Okay. Net stress is minus 14. That's good. Yeah. We could leave it. We could leave it at this level, maybe. Let's cut that out. I can't do it. We're going to build that across. Um, and then, I want a way to get over here. That's why I was looking at this to put a, a suit thing over here. So that we could go through. Like, the water will always be flowing down, but we could walk through it in a suit or something. Because we could also come in on top of this to keep the polluted water from getting out. We could get the mushrooms going. There's a dust cap down here because of temperature. Okay, but dust caps don't don't pollute, right? Produce mushrooms. So I'd love to get those and the thimble reed going. Yeah, indescribably soft reed fiber for clothing production. Okay. But then the Drekos have fibrous bodies, right? Thick woolly fibers only grown in hydrogen climates. Excretion phosphorite. So they excrete phosphorite while the other creatures eat phosphorite. Is that what I'm saying? So it seems. Are these guys too hot? They are. Body temperature. Maybe I should have put the icy fan over on this side. Or maybe I just need two of them. Wow, look at the temperature of that dirt. 158 degrees and climbing. Oh no, now it's down. I guess that's accurate though, because... Compost gets pretty hot. Seems crazy to me though. We've got to have a bunch of skills by now. Ruby, improve carrying too. How do you feel? Get that done and we'll uh, we'll work on your construction as well. Maybe next. Bubbles has three skill points waiting to be used. Why can't she do mechatronics? Because she needs improved carrying too first. Okay.
Joshua, you've got full farming done. Plumbing is good. Abe, you've got full construction and carrying. Okay. Oh, it's crazy. I feel like we've got a long way to go before we are able to get this all working properly. We'll see, though. I really wish they would lay eggs. Are we storing eggs anywhere? Oh, these are diagnostics? Visibility? Beds? Yeah, we've got three shine nymph eggs. Uh, where, where are they at? Up here. Okay. Uh, don't... Don't have shine nymph eggs. Okay. One, one. There's one more somewhere else. Are there shine nymph eggs in here? There should be. Raw egg? Yeah, raw egg can go in here. I'm not... Do we use the lice loaf for anything else, or is it refrigerated? It's refrigerated. Okay. Oh yeah, raw eggs? Okay, so I have that in the wrong place. You should only be cold. Oh, they've eaten up all the stuff in here? Jeez. That's a lot of mealwood. Or lice loaf. I, lice. Lice. Meal lice. There we go. I'll figure it out one of these days. Yeah, so that's making lice loaves. Can we make anything in here with the lice loaves? No. Mush fry. So fried mushroom would be a nice one to get. It says quality pour. Standard pour for the gristleberry, too. Barbecue is good, but we don't have enough critters to to kill. Yeah, these two shine nymphs will be a happy addition. Where's the other one, though? I thought it said we had three eggs, and then it only dumped out two. Is this full of phosphorite again? Look. I really want to see what these... Uh, Sun, sun nymph guys are all about. No phosphorite, I said. Because if it's laying on the ground here, they're definitely going to uh, to eat it. No, I think it's kicked out all of the all the stuff, right? Contents, gristleberry, two thousand, gristleberry, two thousand grams, gristleberry. What? Properties, copper ore, one hundred and sixty-seven degrees. Are you kidding me? I think it is kidding me.
Oh, this guy was never, never planted. Okay. So really, I should move this over to here. Uh, go ahead and deconstruct that, and then yeah, food, critter drop off. Put that there. I guess we could do blossom seeds here, though. They should grow. If this one grows, then this one should grow. Okay. And then we'll go... Uh, two critters. Auto wrangle excess. And it'll just be shine bugs and shine nymphs. Sun bugs and sun nymphs. Sure. Oh, we're almost done. We've almost got all of the pure water down here. How are we, how are we looking? Yeah, it's still kind of got full chunks of pure water. Quite a lot of uh, filthy water coming down, though. This isn't the way that I thought it went. I thought I was going to be filtering, um, filtering what I wanted to come through the output rather than filtering out a specific liquid. It worked out, though, since there was only two kinds of liquids in here. I could just have all of the pure water uh, go on through because I'm filtering out the, the bad water. Yeah, there's still there's still just enough water in here that it's able to, uh, to output still. Yeah, we're gonna need this stuff sooner rather than later, but man, I just don't know about, um, about where. Because we could try and put it up here, but if it produces a bunch of heat, I just don't want it inside the base, you know? It doesn't feel good for it to be there. We're gonna dig that out. You know what, though? Well, the sand's gonna fall anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Nope. Cancel those. We'll see how it goes. Tile set to high priority? No. How are they getting this all done so fast? Oh, because we don't have anything else set up to be done right now. Ugh. I need to figure out suits. Pretty soon. Yeah, looks like we're still getting water out of here. It's not coming out as much now, though. Because I think we're getting down to a lower level. We may want to go ahead and switch this on. Eventually. So that we have a constant flow of clean water. Because, yeah, it's, it's about to... It's about to slow down here. Only I think since this is further up the chain, that this is going to get priority. Which is good and bad. But then we can also just disassemble all of this uh, afterwards, which is kind of nice. Oh yeah, it's getting up to this level. Oh, I didn't know that. I didn't see all that. Why are they coming down here? Did I have stuff set to be vacuumed? To be swept?
I do not remember doing that. Yeah, this is pumping a lot more. This is still pumping, though, which is good. And it's still getting big chunks of pure water through it. I can't believe I missed that, though. Because that's a crazy mix of water down there now. Now, what's this? Saltwater geyser. Are you kidding me? Water weed? Too wet? <laughs> How is water weed too wet? Tell me. Tropical fry egg? Incubating? Elderly, huh? Wow. Are these getting too hot up here? Yeah. They sure in the heck are. Oh. You know what I think I might do is move this over here. Can we rotate it? Nope. Okay. What the heck? The icy fan has no materials? How is that? All you need is water. Oh, the icy fan, which needs ice. That's right. I know what I'm doing. Okay. Uh, look, guys, I don't know why you keep coming down here. Is there a specific reason why? Because they're picking up igneous rock. How much is left here? And they drop it here whenever they... Why is he all happy? Why is he sparkling? Yeah, I mean, we need the igneous rocks, right? So... I guess I'm not too mad. I kind of want to lock this now, though. And then set up another one higher up. So we can use this ladder come up to like here uh, but then we would need another ladder on the inside yeah uh, another manual airlock and then we could do tiles uh, just along there sure Just don't get locked out. Locked out, okay? Yep, you did. You locked him out. Does he have any breathable oxygen here? He does. Okay. Off and on. blowing my mind with the back and forth thing. That seems so, so wasteful. But okay. Um, yeah, if we have the hot water coming down here, I don't know if we want to put a suit thing here so we can walk back and forth. I don't know that it's the spot. Maybe underneath here? We could have like a suit station in here since that has a airlock. just don't know. We could tunnel underneath to get to here. Alternatively, though, over here, we've got the hydrogen and stuff. Oh no, there's no quick access to slime. Up here is the slime, up top. So if we, if we tunneled over into here to get this chlorine out for a suit station like in this area, we could clean this out and turn it into one. Maybe that's what we do. 
And then we could come up here for the for the slime and the algae and stuff. We just have to make sure that this water doesn't end up in our base. We have to dig underneath it a pretty good ways and then up near it but not into it, you know what I mean? Like put in tiles on this side and then dig down into here to take that and this so that it can't escape. Okay. Let's get started on something like that. We'll do this for now and just close that off. I don't know what this is going to be. We could also deconstruct those. It's a long way from all of our power generation and stuff. Uh, but I, I feel like it's going to take us a while before we eat up all of this water here. This guy's still, still trying to pump water up. And it's still got some clean water in it. Oh, I guess we're going to have to dig these two as well. Now this is just an expensive door. <laughs> oh man. I kind of want to pump the polluted water back up here, but also I don't. We could deconstruct all of this stuff though. Demolish? I don't know if we'll get materials back from it or not though. It's kind of a shame. Okay, I completed this, no problem. Deconstruct that. And I think we need another icy fan uh, over here. Yeah, so we have we have some food. We're actually dropping on food. We need to get these lice loops, meal lice going. And I think I want to do the same thing down here and move this farm station over here. And the IC fan over here. I just don't understand why it continues to get warmer underneath. But tell me, we totally did research something to cool down the air. Liquids, gases. Where was it? Or was it in here? Canister, emptier, oxygen mass, no. Was it over here? Thermoregulator, that's the one. Yeah, cools gas pipe through it, but outputs heat in its vicinity. Okay. That's the one that we need. And our only cool air is up here now. The water keeps things kind of cool in this area. If we could get all the power stuff underneath the water, it would help uh, insulate us from it much more. But that's all chlorine and stuff, so I don't feel comfortable digging into it just now. We have the airlock there, but we'll be constantly letting chlorine seep out. This has got to be insulating a little bit too, but that's a long way to go down. And this isn't empty yet. Let's put a tile there. I don't understand how this water is sitting inside this hole. <laughs> that seems really awkward to me. Yeah, I can't reach water now. That's okay. It'll fill up again eventually. It'll just take some time. This is still pumping water, so we don't have anything to worry about, I think. Yeah, it's still full. Cool. 
Yeah, because we could bring a ladder all the way down. Oh, did I? I built that a long time ago, I think, actually. Deodorizer, deodorizers seem to have been doing well. Oh, we've got three three nymphs that are out, three eggs that are in. That's good. Let's get more critter bait in here. Has this one been built yet? Not quite. Okay, so now we could deconstruct this. Oh, push the wrong button. It's fine. They're still coming down here to dig for igneous rocks. It's so weird to me. That's okay. Okay, so now we could go with a ladder all the way down here. Then we could dig. Uh, I kind of want, I kind of want to replace this with tile again. That can be closed off. I also wouldn't mind trying to do two, three, four, something like this. Yeah, because if we uh, put the tile in, that'll raise the water level up again, and this will be able to pump water out once more. Let's see, we could dig to there and put a couple more tiles in. Oh no, he died. He perished. Unrefrigerated, sterile atmosphere? So will it never uh, never go bad? Because that would be kind of nice. We could just turn it into... Uh... Oh. Yeah. Igneous rock. What was I seeing? Research complete for HVAC thermoregulator. Okay. Yeah, we need to put that underneath as well. So if we tile this in, we could even dig uh, one spot underneath. Just three, three up for now. Something like this. We could eventually break into here as well. Build this ladder straight down and deconstruct this one, put an airlock in here, kind of a thing. Which we may do. Uh, but we'll also tile underneath here. Yeah, that's starting to pump again. Oh, uh, we'd have to lock open an airlock, and I'm not really comfortable with that right now. I guess it wouldn't, uh, wouldn't have to be for very long. That's on a nine to unlock. Yeah, here they come. All right, good job. Okay, we let a bunch of oxygen out, but fine now. Now we'll turn these back down to a uh, two or five. There. So yeah, we've got more than what we need in here. We'll get them wrangled up pretty soon though, I'm sure. Oh man, we're getting there. We're getting there. We're getting some things done. It's not everything that I want done, but it's working for now.
Uh, we can cancel this one for the moment. Then I wonder if this coolness will kind of rise up after we get the machines out of there. Because if it does, we may uh, remove the insulation here. But also with the thermoregulator, we might build it kind of near here, and then pipe the water or pipe the uh, the gas through here. The problem with that is that um, it should be somewhere where there's a lot of oxygen, right? So we'd kind of want all of the oxygen diffusers and the thermal regulator in the same room, I think. I'm not... I don't have that set up in my mind just now. We'll think about it, though. Uh, is that under utilities? Yeah, thermal regulator. How big is that thing? Two by two? It needs water. No, is that uh, gas? Gas. That's correct. That we could do. What is it? What does it output as far as temperature? 167 is the overheat temperature. And it reduces temperature by 25 degrees. Okay. But what's the... Yeah, all of this is really hot back here. This is kind of cool because there's water here. But once that's gone, our insulation buffer is going to be non-existent. So if we're piping air into it that's 100 degrees, plus whatever uh, heat it's outputting. Hmm. I don't know. Doesn't seem quite right to me. Gonna need more ice machines too. Those require power. We've got six diffusers and it says insufficient oxygen generation. That's a bit sad. We have another way of producing oxygen, don't we? Electrolyzer converts water into oxygen and hydrogen. It becomes idle when the area reaches maximum pressure capacity. So it just outputs oxygen from water. Okay, it's a two by two. We could output the hydrogen like in an area like this somewhere, except the the air pressure is already really high in these areas. Hmm. To think about that too. Very breathable, polluted oxygen at 2,000 sometimes. Yeah. It's hitting 3 and 4,000 at times? How? How is it so dense? I don't understand. Yeah. They don't have much else to do, so they're getting down here. Let's put another tile right here. Uh, should we should we insulate this from the heat? Because it doesn't seem to be cooling as much as the clean water does. Maybe we should then, just to make sure that it's that it's insulated a bit better. Slow heating. There. Yeah, this is all really hot on this side. I don't like that. I 
I kind of want to do another insulated tile layer through here. To keep this area from overheating. It's hard to say if we can do that or not. All of this is too hot now. 87 degrees? It's just too hot. Even with this guy right here. I wonder if we put an airflow tile uh, right here, if that would make a difference. What am I making those out of? Copper? Okay. Oh yeah, we've got all kinds of sun nymphs in here now. Well, shine nymphs. Yeah, some ice in here, no. Insufficient though, still. 82 degrees over here, thankfully, but it's just too hot in this area. Yeah, that heat is just really seeping in now. We need to get this area dug out so that we can move everything down here. two, three, four. So yeah, this would be the next level underneath this one. Oh, we need these machines moved so bad. So bad. So bad. They're getting there, slowly but surely. It's just taking time. We may need some oxygen masks for going down in here, because this is going to fill up with carbon dioxide, for sure. We have almost no plants now. New printables are available with a printing pod. Oh, a new dupe. We can't right now. We're running out of food because we can't get the temperature down far enough. 84, 85, 86. Dang it. It's just not staying down. These three over here are growing, but everything else is still cooking. Oh, come on, guys. Quit getting those igneous rocks. Quit it. Is that still what they're collecting down here? Yeah. And they keep dropping them when they get up here. There's a whole bunch of it here, though. And up here, too. All kinds of igneous rocks. I'm guessing this abyssalite stuff uh, transfers heat really well. But the igneous rock I thought was slow heating. But it just seems to be a much hotter biome. Iron ore is over here. That blue looking stuff. Good. Yeah, maybe they'll go for this igneous rock now instead of the stuff that's in here. Oh, it's going. It's going. They're getting it done. It's taking a little while, but they're getting it done. How much uh, pressure is this? 300? That's not bad at all. Yeah, it's not very breathable, but uh, it's better than... Better than something toxic, you know. 
like a gamer. So toxic. But this isn't bad positioning to get at the slime too. Because we could have the finery refinery down here. See if this is a floor, we've got one, two, three, four. Yeah, and then the floor would technically want to be down here, but I don't know if we'll do that or not. If we do dig into here, we'd want another uh, deodorizer, either down there or up here uh, to clean it out. This guy is almost empty, too. I think, yeah, this guy's pumped through all of the water that it can so far. There's still some regular water in here. Oh, I didn't think about it being germy, though. Because it's got to be, because it was mixing with the polluted water. Is everything up here germy now? No. The sinks and the shower are still fine. It's just the toilets that are... that are germy. Okay. We're almost there. Uh, we want to dig... all of this. And put tiles underneath it. I think we will go ahead and put a um, an airlock right here. So I guess another another tile right here would be fine. Well, this water is probably going to come out, but we'll just mop it up. It'll be all right. What was this? What's this bad thing? Gas reservoir stores any gas resources piped into it. Okay. So we could use that to keep from mixing gases, right? If we dug in kind of underneath this chlorine. And we could just install a pump and pump it into a reservoir. Once it was empty, we could just walk in and out of here, no problem. Pick up the balm lilies and stuff. Because they've got decor value, don't they? I know the mirth uh, leaf does. Like 25 a piece. But I think mirth leaf has to live in chlorine. No, that, that is chlorine. I wanted to learn about the uh, mirth leaf. Okay. Atmosphere, oxygen, polluted oxygen, carbon dioxide, chlorine, hydrogen. Okay. So any of those. All right. We can also dig this now. Like that. I mean, I feel like they have most of the materials down here that they need already to do all of this. It says unreachable, but they can definitely reach these. Unbreathable. Maybe that's what I saw. Kind of raise the water level. I think this can suck it straight off of this tile, so we shouldn't have to worry about that. I could also just mop this up and then turn this back on, decommission this, and take the pipes away up and around so we don't have to worry about it anymore. I'm trying to think what we need down here also, though. It's just electricity for these and this. And these, but they have to have algae delivered to them. Is Rowan the only one who can who can dig these? Because I felt like we had a different person. Yeah, he's only at hard digging one. He doesn't even have super hard digging. Joshua has super hard digging. Travaldo has super duper hard digging, so that's why he's a digger. Okay.
Yeah. We're pretty steadily running out of, of food and stuff. Hey! He was very excited about that, whatever it was. Let's do a... yeah, Igneous. I think we can reach that from the... nope, unreachable. Oh no, where's this water coming from? How the heck did it get up here? Ridiculous. Pop it up, you weirdos. They did good. Well done. Okay, so we can dig all this out now. Uh, we'll go with regular tiles right here. Oh, what? We're getting there, we're getting there. Oh, let's see. Insulated with igneous rock. We're gonna do it. We're gonna come straight across here. Okay. Uh, we're going to priority nine. This one and this one. So those get closed up as fast as possible. And we're gonna dig. those. Add a five. That's good. Do we want to dig this or do we want to put a, uh, do we want to put a wall here or something? Did we store away hatch eggs? I think we were storing them in here, weren't we? Yeah, zero kilograms though. I haven't seen many other hatches. There was the one here. So we could wrangle him. There's no grooming station to make them happy, so I wonder if they will mostly lay eggs when they're happy. And he says he's happy, though, so I wonder if that's the case or not. We don't have anything that produces polluted dirt now, do we? The lavatory, blue water, food poisoning, heat. Why does everything produce heat? Okay. All right, but we need to get that stuff moved down here. Uh, this still needs to be built, so we'll wait on that. So what, maybe the ice machines first, even? Man, transporting water down here is gonna be annoying, though. Let's see, yeah. A couple of ice makers, and then for power, we want some jumbo batteries. How many do we have? Five. Okay, and then a coal generator. Right there. We'll go wire them. I wonder if that stacked the wires where I was clicky clicking right there. Did he really not finish that one piece? Yeah, they could totally build up to there. Yeah, we didn't let too much escape. They got those built pretty quick. I saw a little bit of pink gas up here. It's hydrogen, I think. Oh, wait a second. I guess all of those need to be done at a nine. 
if we don't want gas to escape. I didn't realize they were all that low. Uh, how bad is a little bit of chlorine in our in our base, though? Where'd this hatch come from? Rowan, no! Rowan, get up! Okay. Oh, Ruby almost got stuck down there, too. And now Ruby's confused. Okay, there she goes. Hello. Who's not building this last piece and why? We had all of the chlorine escape because they all just decided to not do this job. No sleeping. Well, I guess it doesn't matter now. Let's see. Yeah, chlorine is all escaping. Phosphorite is here. There's copper and stuff. You know what? Forget about it. It's over. It's already all escaped. There's nothing we can do about it. Let's just put this down here. And we'll upgrade this. We'll dig. Let's see, that's... We could get over onto here, and then up over here. There. Dig those out when you get the chance, and then sweep all that stuff up. The heck. Sweep all these up, too. And those. I can't tell. I think the chlorine is hanging around uh, down low. Interestingly enough. Okay. We're getting temperatures back to where we can grow stuff over here, so that's good. We could also probably do with, like, one oxygen diffuser down here, or maybe we want to do an algae terrarium instead. Overheat temperature is 167. Maybe it's not safe down here. What's the overheat temperature on this? 167. Yeah, it may not, it may not survive down here. So temperature right now, 90. What's it here? 125? 123. Maybe it'll survive. Yeah. Have a move down here. Deconstruct. Okay. They're getting the wire in. That's good. That's good. Oh, this can't be deconstructed yet because this hasn't been built. Unreachable. I don't think it is. I think that one needs to be done right now. Because I'm sure you can reach that from this ladder. Oh, this can't uh, reach anymore. So this needs to be enabled. 
Uh, then we can we can mop all of this. Uh, we can deconstruct this. And this. And that. Okay. For plumbing pipes. We can deconstruct those. Yeah. Yeah. We can leave this here, just in case any more pure water drops in here. Uh, but all the rest of that can be taken down. Should be fine. Finally. Okay, thank you. Now we can deconstruct this. I knew that was reachable. point earned. Good job. Sorry I can't give it to you right now, but one of these days. Yeah, because we still need to be producing ice. Even if we get those others deconstructed. Nice. Ice received. Ice delivered. Pleasant chit chat. Good. Good. Oh, yeah, he's running the machine. Somebody. Oh, that one's not loaded. Okay, so we can deconstruct this now. Oh, I forgot about the coal storage. I guess that would be nice to, to have down here. Or Let's put it... Let's put it over here, actually. You know what? Let's be crazy. We'll put the algae terrarium right next to the ice machine, because of course that's going to work. Okay. And then we'll copy and paste. Even though it's not complicated to do that. And you can be deconstructed as well. Wire can go. And dig. There. Where'd we get fungal spores? Oh my gosh. Seed of a dust cap. I'll probably have to put that down here somewhere, right? Since it'll be in the dark or whatever. Or maybe this one's in the dark enough where we can plant it up here. Since it's not receiving uh, light bugs, this one is. How'd this guy get here? We don't have a drop off point here. Oh well. All of our food's rotted. All we have are raw, raw foods. Can we even eat these? Meal ice we don't have. Muck root we have 82 kilograms of. What the heck else do we have? Max 150? Oh, so yeah, that's over, that's over half full. What the heck is muck root good for though? 
Mark. Oh, come on. Mark. Root. Seedless fruit, upsettingly bland aftertaste. Cannot be replanted. Digging up buried objects may uncover a muck root. Quality grizzly minus one. Spoil time never. Okay, that's good. So it's like a emergency. Emergency stuff. Where is our exosuit again? Is it a station? It is. Refined metal we need. So we need to make those other... The other things anyways. Refinement. Yeah, metal refinery. Significantly heats and outputs the liquid pipe into it. Produces refined metals from raw metal ore. Overheat temperature 167. Auto inputs enable disable. Overheat temperature plus 27 degrees. Plus 27 degrees. Thermally reactive, but still plus 27 degree overheat temperature. So with granite, it's got a decor increase and overheat temperature increase. Slow heating, too. I wonder if that's probably what we would want. Fine metals are necessary to building advanced electronics and technologies. Okay. Humph. Harumph. Let's see. Oh. Oh, I just came up with a splendid idea for our... Uh, oxygen stuff. We could do it over here. Metal refinery. Maybe we just shove it in right here. All that gas would, would escape then. Uh, maybe we just shove it, shove it right here. But back one. Uh, drop some tiles. There. Do a dig. There. Try to work on that. Okay. Uh, deconstructed. Good, good, good. We'll priority six this guy. Get them broken down, and then we'll sweep the the coal downstairs. Deconstruct that wire. That wire is already set to be deconstructed. Coal, get swept. Thimble reed seed. Okay, let's see real quick. If we can get one of them uprooted. Yeah, he's doing it right now. Never mind. He's not. He's doing it right now. Okay. So do we have fungal spores? Plant. We'll see how it do up there. Get a priority six on these. Oh, it doesn't have any algae, I don't think. Oh, let's see. This has got to output what? Because we might have to run other liquids in here. What liquid output is it? Outputs a liquid piped into it. Alright, but how do we... No liquid intake. Copper ore. We don't want to do all of it, though, right? We 
We only need it for the for those stations. Yeah, 100 kilograms. So this does 100 each time. Yeah, 100 and 100. This requires 200, and that's 400. So that's a total of 800 then. For one one set of stations. We'll do that. So that'll be, what, 2,000 kilograms of copper ore? Do we even have that much? We can, we can wire it in easy, just right here. Takes a lot of power, though. Jeez. Oh, uh, oh, we can, can get rid of some more, some more power too. Yeah, all that needs to be there. This comes up here. That's a scrubber. This probably doesn't need to exist here anymore. But I guess just in case the carbon dioxide gets upsettingly dense around here, we can turn it back on. It's got water and stuff running through it, too. Yeah. Oh. I need some water. Speaking of water, I need water. Let's fill up the old cup. There we go. This is tough. I'm not sure. Man. It all seems so wild to me. I feel like I could be doing way better, too, but... This is my first colony, so... I guess I'm hoping it's good. Let's do this. Then, if we consider closing this in, maybe we could do oxygen here, but I think lower would be better. How did... Where did it all... I thought we only dug out like to here. Okay, anyway. So it has it's a waiting coolant. It has no coolant. I guess it needs water, right? Duplicants will not fabricate items unless rece recipes are queued. So if we bring water down here, because there is there is fresh water that we could bring down here. Right? I wonder if we should tile it up so that we could put it in the wall, just in case we need to do uh, like bad water out. Because we could we could bring the polluted water in through here, and then up the ladder and out the same output, right? If there is polluted water output by it. But it says, what did it say? It outputs the same liquid, yeah. Significantly heats and outputs a liquid piped into it. So if we pipe filthy water in here, then it would be superheated, and we could just output it back into here, uh, superheated. It's not ideal, but it could be done. Two, three. If we insulated these tiles, we could totally do that and not worry about it. We could ladder over here. Only if I wanted to make make this a real room, right? The one, two, three, four rule is right here instead, which is fine. I could do that, no problem. So let's put some more insulation in right here. Well, maybe not that far. Oh, well, it doesn't hurt anything, I guess. There. Yeah, and then we'll go like this. Insulate that off. And then I think maybe maybe even insulate a tile along here. Yeah, and we leave this open. Now all of this is working. 
It is heating up. Is this uh, dead? No. It just needs algae. That's all. I think we're running out of algae very quick. I think we need to get a, a suit set up soon so that we can get to this slime and process that down. There's also algae up here too. We could build we could build like a collection reservoir by digging this middle part out first and then run all of this polluted water into that while we dig out the rest of it, I guess. That's an idea. We might want it as wide well, we could cut in here and it could run out this way. So if we dug, did some tiles up to here and then cut this one open, it would have to run out into into that. Okay. Uh, but we need we need Atmo suits before we can do that, and we we'll have to pipe oxygen like into the suits or something. I've seen it done before, but I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know how it's done, so it's difficult to explain. Uh, let's get let's get a ladder going on the outside of here. Yeah. We'll cancel this one and we'll dig this out. Okay, we still got eggs brewing in here. This little guy needs to be wrangled and taken to where he's supposed to live, but for right now he's alright. Okay, what's wrong with you? Fertilization and atmosphere? Oh, he needs slime, that's right. Okay. He's fine with the darkness. The air pressure is is greater than a thousand. Oh no. Okay. What about these guys? Up to ten thousand. So they would be fine if we were at a thousand. So we'll have to to air regulate this one, which means we would need an actual uh, airlock on this door too. We need air pressure to regulate this. It might be easier to cool if it's not so dense. Uh, but that also means that these need to be replaced. Let's make them hydroponic tiles too. Sure. And then we'll run the, the plumbing on through. There. Okay. So they're washing their hands faster than they can use the bathroom, which means the sinks open up by the time they're done. So everybody is able to wash their hands on the way out with only two and three. At least from that short observation there. Are these both set to six? They are. And they have ice in them right now. They just don't have any output at the moment. Okay, so we could tile this up still. We'll deconstruct that and dig this out. No, that's only a uh, by three, isn't it? I don't know how I had that figured as uh, by four. And we can just ladder down into here is okay. And this whole room will be oxygen generation. I'll show you how I plan on doing it, but uh, the the heat thing will be down here at the bottom, and maybe I ought to uh, cut this off too with insulated tiles. Yeah, and actually, if that's the case, we ought to cut these off too. Uh, cancel, cancel this. And we could insulate these tiles. Uh, put a couple of airlocks in. And deconstruct everything up to there. I think there's a lot of polluted air escaping right now, isn't there? Maybe not. 
I think they were walking in and out of here so much the deodorizer has cleaned up most of the polluted air that was in here. It's mostly carbon dioxide now. Okay. But we are going to need a uh, ventilation. We're going to need a gas pump in here. I'm going to want... Oh, man. Let's see. We're going to want a... Not a filter. We want a valve. Controls the gas volume permitted through pipes. Connects to an automation grid to automatically turn gas flow off when the specified amount has passed through it. Connects to an automat automation grid to turn gas flow on or off. Where's the... Atmos sensor. Sends a green signal or a red signal when a gas pressure enters the chosen range. There we go. When ambient temperature enters the chosen range. Okay. So we need one of these, but we need the refined metal uh, to do it. So we can build the gas pump, but we won't be able to make any progress beyond that. Yeah, so long as they don't stand around and chit-chat too much while they're in the bathroom, this is working just fine the way that it is. I still say there's nothing wrong with adding one more sink and one more toilet, though. So we may do that eventually. I deconstruct this toilet and this shower. Move the shower here. Put in a sink and put two toilets back here. This double insulated thing probably doesn't have to happen anymore. This, these are still heating things up, right? Heat production. So really we need to uh, deconstruct these. And probably the wires that go to them as well. Yeah. Good. Okay, we're getting this done. Why is this light guy down here? What are you doing in here? How did you even get down here? And why? He's glum? Well, I would be too if I lived down here for some reason. Okay. Oh yeah, they're building this too. We really need the, um, the refinery running though. I need to get this going, so... Where did the sand come from? Did it fall down from up here somewhere? And like fall through the tiles or something? There's sand up here too. Yeah. That's so crazy. What the heck is happening right now? We're gonna leave it for now. Uh, so we need plumbing. We've got the pump here already, but it's not down low enough. And this one's trying to be filtered as well. Okay. So we'll put a pump here. We'll run... I still haven't gotten used to that. We'll run water... Got to go in up here. Then it's got to come out somewhere too. So we got to dig, dig this up.
All right. So then the plumbing is going to go out here. Uh, we can't... We can't reach it. We can't reach it if it goes here. We can't reach this one. And all this is crammed in too tightly uh, to get it to go. So we're going to have to deconstruct this. Maybe even this to move it over. Yeah. So if we deconstruct on a six, this guy, then we could maybe build one on a six over here. There. Oh man. What a shame. Uh, we'll get these out of here. We'll get. Let's see. It's got to come down to there. So we'll just put the pipe in first. Build pipe. Slow heating, or do we care that much? Thermally reactive. We've only got 300 of these, though. Now let's use the regular pipe. Okay. Yeah, so that's got to be done. I think all of this is unreachable right here. Yeah. So we need to put ladders in there, maybe there. Okay, so now what's, what's unreachable? Over here. Okay, so this is going to have to be uh, deconstructed uh, also. It's not running right now anyway, so it's no big loss. She stopped mid dig. Okay. Then we can uh, deconstruct. Uh, we don't. We don't have to prioritize these getting dug, and we'll put the algae terrariums back in. Okay. Now this can be deconstructed as well. Uh, this guy should be at a six. That guy at a six. We'll get the wiring done. If I can find it. Okay, in there. We'll deconstruct. Never mind. They already got the wire from from the old one. That's fine. Uh, coal generator, then. I'll put you right back. Okay. We still need the output, though. Uh, we could do a liquid vent. Let's see. I kind of want it up high so it doesn't... So it doesn't run out. You know what I mean? Liquid pipe. We're just going to pull this across here. And on up. And in there. So then that's apparently going to heat up this area real badly. So that's all it needed was coolant, huh? And I just spent all that time not understanding what it what it was trying to do. Yeah, let's get a get a sweep on all this. We still have space. Most of this stuff up here is cleaned up too, so that's good. Oh yeah. We're getting temperature back, boys and girls. Why is there why is there water all through here? Who leaked water? It has to be the the cooler. I think ice just sat in there and uh, ended up running out. Yeah, we'll need a real door manual airlock right here.
I think we can build all of this. I think. there too. We'll get that. Oh, come on. <laughs> he just decided not to finish. That's so weird to me. Like, please finish it. What's the temperature looking like now? It's heating up down here. 94, 93. And it should be cooling down up here. It was over, over in this area because that's why we have things growing now. Everything up here is still Unbreathable. Are we getting carbon dioxide trapped in here? I think we are. Well, it doesn't matter. We'll just pump all of the gas out. Huh. How would we do that? Because I don't want carbon dioxide to build up in here. But if we put an airflow tile, this pump will never work. Yep. If I copy this setting, can I still place it on this one? I can't. Okay. There. So as we get fungal spores, we'll end up uh, being able to do... Why are these guys standing around? Idle? Really? You guys don't have anything to do. Waiting for materials. Waiting coolant. This thing is not hooked up to power. Oh. What the heck? Okay. Deconstruct that too. And then... Uh, I guess, yeah, we'll go through the odorizer and uh, bring the power down. Let's get that done, please. Uh, I'd like for this ladder to also be deconstructed. Then we want some insulated tiles here. Keep this cool. It is cool, right? It's cooler than the other... other stuff. I'll bet if we bust into this, it won't stay cool for long, though. And I also wonder, will this force this water level up? Or when this water gets down here, will it see that there's water level here and stop at, at this level filling up? That's definitely something I would like to test. Yeah, things are definitely cooling down up here. Very breathable, but still 89. So we need both of these working. I feel like this guy should be down here and the cool air will rise, but... Right here is fine, because these, these rooms are still pretty bad. Okay, this is working. And we've got the ore cooking now. Will it just spit it out here when it's done? Or does somebody need to be working it also? Oh, we're full up on storage now, too? Okay. We could put more storage along here, I guess. It feels like we're acquiring an excess of storage, though.
Lovely, lovely. There, okay, it does need to be operated, and Ruby is doing the work. Hungry, holding breath. There's a little bit of oxygen being produced down here. Insufficient resources. Water. Water needs to be brought down here. That's kind of a bummer. Oh, we don't have a water bottler, though. Is also a bummer. Uh, is it under plumbing? Yeah, petrol pump. So this needs to be here. And it can't be rotated. And a ladder right next to it. So that we can start transporting water. What a fool I am to not realize that that was a necessity. Metal tiles. Build walls and floors of rooms. Significant increase. Oh, duplicate run speed. Nice. Okay. Uh, I do want to sweep up this stuff, though. Is this polluted air? Yeah. Polluted oxygen. That's okay. We'll get this place cleaned out soon. Don't worry. Oh, wow. Now that we put water in here, the oxygen is really pumping out. I guess there wasn't much um, density in the carbon dioxide down here anyway, so the water or the oxygen is just loving it. Just filling it right up. So what's the temperature of this water now? Yeah, it's heating up from dripping out of this side. So that might end up being too hot to walk through eventually. I think we've done all of the digging that we can do in here, though. So I think we need to get this stuff out of here before it uh, becomes a problem. And let's... Copy-paste. So we have plenty of room. My man. What's he picking up granite for? I've got other stuff set at a priority six, and he's picking up granite? Oh, this should be a six. Also. Yeah, so we still got ice going. There's more polluted oxygen getting pulled up here. Balm Lily. Let's take a look at it. Uh, medicinal herb, I see. High vitamin concentrations, produce acids. Acetyl... Sal 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 salicylic? Acetyl salicylic acid? Wow. Commonly known as aspirin. Okay. That's a lot easier to say, too. Aspirin. Life cycle, atmosphere, chlorine. Air pressure, 150 G minimum. Balm lily flower. Decor plus 15, but if it needs chlorine atmosphere, I don't think it'll grow in a in a house plant pot, right? These guys still can't cool down over here. This is still too high density. Okay. How much of this copper do we have now? I mean, we've made some, right? Already? Oh. 
I just thought about that. I wonder if there's germs on this thing because of this. I'm sure enough there is. Oh, there's germs in here too. No, not in my good water, no. It's fine. Everybody's sleeping. How much algae do we have left? 21 tea. All right, we definitely need to get going on the algae refinement. Oh man. Oh geez. Oh man, oh geez. What's the temperature up here? 84? Okay, so if we cooled this down and pumped it into the base, it would probably be pretty decent. I even wouldn't mind doing another insulated tile or two here. We could put one of the output vents like right here of the oxygen so that it flows up and it's nice and cool for this area. Maybe that would be too cool though. What's the temperature? 50 to 86. No, that would not be too cool. Not too cool for school. Just cool enough for a decent amount of school. Phosphorite, granite, copper, coal. That's dirt there, some algae. Okay, all right. Okay. Uh, let's see. Let's see if we have... Yes, we do. We do have what we need. A green signal or a red signal when gas pressure enters the chosen range. So I think I have to run the... I think I have to run the electricity through it. So that it'll turn this off, right? Or do I run a... Uh, automation wire through it. Because where, where even were those? Under power? There's a switch, wire bridge. Um, I thought it was under automation. Copper. Auto outputs, gas pressure, decor minus five. Atmo sensors can be used to prevent excess oxygen production and overpressurization. High thermal conductivity. Yeah, it would attach to, to this right here. Input, output. Ribbon, input, output. Reset, control. Grid status, green or red. Okay, so we want this built here. For sure. But then how do we, how do we wire it over? Where's the automation? Let's see. Automation wire. Yeah. Smart home. Switches. Okay. So we need to research that then. And that's under computers maybe? Smart home. Automation wire. Okay. Oh, I guess this airflow tile doesn't help either. We'll need to, to cover that off. Research is being done. Things are being taken away, brought in. All this stuff down here could be swept at some point. Now we've got so many mealwood seeds too. Oh, that's heating up so much, holy cow. It did say that it greatly, greatly heated the water. Wow. That's crazy hot, though. Okay, 
sleeping. Why is this damage overloading? What? The wire? Okay. So we need to... Let me see. Well, I want to move the oxygen production elsewhere. Maybe this wire can get repaired or something? It's on auto repair. Oh, they fixed it already. Okay. Yeah, this is filling up with oxygen, so we're not going to be, like, dying down here all the time. Okay. Smart home research complete. So automation, we need the automation wire. Connect sensors right in there. Okay. And I want you to be send green if uh, below 1,000. That's fine. No, no. If above 1,000, send green. Yeah. Okay, so now we need this to be plugged in. Which is going to overload that one even more, I think. No, that was this one. So this is going in this way. Why is this here? Oh, lights. Okay. I don't really want to run it back here. I'm going to be super extra. And we're going to do that. But then we need a gas vent just right outside is fine. Or do we want to put it below? Because that's right next to the cooler too. So that would cool this down here. And that cool air would help cool this maybe. Does that make sense to anybody else? What is the temperature overlay right here? You know what? We're just going to make it real simple. And put the gas vent right here. And then, I keep doing that, I'm sorry. A regular old gas pipe made out of sandstone because we've got thousands of it there perfect get her done children once we get that all hooked in then the uh, this should grow after that you know what maybe we should do um, sin green if it's above oh Can I not uh, put in a... There. 900. So we can keep it always below... Oh, I right-clicked and did it go away? Yeah, it did. 900. Why won't it do 900? Uh, red light, green light achievement unlocked. Okay. Colony achievement. Automate a building using sensors or switches from the automation tab in the build menu. We did. We did it. And since it's right here next to the door, too, I feel like um, it's going to be pulling oxygen over from here. Anytime this area gets greater than a thousand, it'll, uh, it'll shove it out. Get those pipes built, folks. Get them built. Oh, yeah, it's finally cooling down around there. Over here, not so much. I think they're delivering the ice over here first. And this one just isn't getting any, is the problem. Maybe I should put an ice machine over here. So they could just jump and deliver it. But it would keep it pretty warm. You know, I think we could probably get rid of this, though, now. I wonder if there's a bunch of wires and stuff I just got rid of behind it, though. No. Nothing. 
Yeah, we should be all right to, to deconstruct those. Food poisoning. But they wash their hands. I think that, like, sterilizes them, right? I feel like uh, it does. Okay. It's working already. What, what's your problem? Oh, yeah. Slime it needs. So, too, we need to make sure that we don't... Um... That we don't process all of the slime into algae, either. Which is kind of... Man, it feels excessive. It'll be fine. Speaking of algae... How tall is this? Four. We dig up here, we hit this. Let's not worry about that right now. I need to get uh, suits and stuff going. Uh, so, if we were to go to stations, Atmo suit, dock, checkpoint. Marks the threshold where duplicates must change into or out of Atmo suits. Must be built next to an Atmo suit dock. We also need to get the textile loom and stuff going. This requires a bunch of power, too. We're going to need another power generator down here. That much has become clear. We've got a little bit of slime lung, though, in the lower bits, so I don't know if I want to dig straight down. We could dig a two-tall, but this is a three-tall entity. So we could, we could place it over here and then have it run. And I don't know, do we want it on a different circuit? Right, because that was saying it was overloading. This one was. Yeah, it's got 4,000 of 1,000. If all power consumers become active at once. Current load is only 200. 500 sometimes. And these are still active too. these. That's 800 total. Minus 5. 240. 240. So that's 480. 600. 720. And 5. So if we cut this off and put like one battery in here, we should be able to run all of that. With those two, no problem. We'll get a a big battery. Outputs heat, though. Which is really frustrating. Oh, it's also running uh, his light. Which isn't that much, though. Here. Let's be sneaky. We'll put it down in the area that's already... Uh, already heated. But then we're just going to run the wire... That. Oh. This is where we can pick the pick the eggs. Sun nymphs? Why is this one lit up? Like we can use them. Do we have some sun nymphs alive? I think we don't, but maybe we do. Long commute still. Cycle 132, report ready. 880 germs. That's not bad compared to what I see laying around. Oh no. We're running out of food really fast, actually. All of these meal lice not working properly is really messing me over. And I don't get it because this is obviously getting ice as well as this. Oh, maybe, um, maybe instead of this kind of tile, we need the other kind? Where was the one that transfers... Yeah. Accelerates or buffers heat dispersal based on the construction material. So we want to go for something that transfers heat really fast. Yeah. 
plain copper. Slow heating. High thermal conductivity. And decor plus 20. Cannot be built inside tile. Oh, okay. So these don't create a room. Okay. What if we did a metal metal tile, though? Yeah, high thermal conductivity. So that would still work. Yeah. So that way these two rooms can share temperature a little bit easier. So that just needs fertilization. Atmosphere is still too much. down below a thousand wait it says air pressure to 10,000 150 to 10,000 atmosphere carbon dioxide oh okay it only breathes carbon dioxide I didn't know that so I do want carbon dioxide to build up in here okay that's good to know then So yeah, because this is really cool here. This should cool down faster. These hydroponic farms, though. Like, did they not... Cause this water should be pretty cool coming out of here. Right on this end. It's very cool. Maybe I need denser... Denser pipes? Right, maybe I'm uh, thermally reactive. We could use that through here. And then the temperature is still cool inside this wall, too. So, yeah. Sedimentary rock. We don't have any. I see. Thermally reactive obsidian is, though. Okay, that's going to be all of our obsidian. And then if we did the uh, resistant, resistant stuff coming up this direction. Uh, yeah, not the, not the temperature. We wanted the thermally resistant stuff. So that it heats up slower. Oh, why isn't it showing me the overlay? Okay. Well, this will get us a lot of sandstone back, that's for sure. All right, and then this was broken. That heats up slower. Yeah. And then we don't care if the output heats up, but this we want all, uh, we want this to be resistant. Why doesn't this have power now? are all pumping. Oh yeah, it is. It is tripping. Why? 
Is it because this? Yeah, when this comes on, it seems to be too much for it. Okay. So we're going to have to split up our, our power then. To... Um... So what do we got on here? 240 for this. I can't see what that is. Like 70. Oh, all of these are going to be on a different circuit though. 120 and 60. So if we cut this off here. Wait, what do we have down here? Three pumps is too many. I can tell you that much already. That's, it would only take four of these to fill up a whole circuit. And this is 1,200 on its own. So every time this comes on, it's tripping something. Okay. So I need a heavier duty uh, power line, I think is what it comes down to. So I can do more on them. Uh, power. Heavy watt wire. That's what we need. Because I don't mind putting another coal generator like here. Or... I guess we could dig this out and put it over here. And hook it in. We could dig this down and put it right here. Right? Right? If we were to dig yeah three tiles and then that's got slime lung on it we could go this way three tiles also and still not be into there yeah so we'll do something like that this abyssalite stuff is going to take our big man to do that. At night it seems to be running just fine. Is this really running uh, clean water still? No, it's not. So I feel like we could take this down. I feel like we could deconstruct all of this right here. Yeah. And then if we go into plumbing pipes, uh, are we still on deconstruct? Okay. Yeah. So that whole system can be undone. There's a little water over here, but I'm not. I'm not even going to uh, bother with it. Maybe we could try and uh, mop at this level. Not on floor. Okay. So we're not going to worry about there being clean water in here. There's a little bit over here on this side, too. I wonder if it's on a ladder, if it'll clean. No, not on floor. Okay. No, oh, what? Chlorine? It is leaking through? Or maybe it sank down from the top, because we did let out some chlorine up there, too. I didn't think it would sink through this bit right here, though. Because it seems like it is breaking out of here. Maybe I'm wrong. Our meal lice is all dead again. What the heck happened? Why is it so hot up here again? Eighty-six point two. Crazy. Yeah, that keeps dying too. We don't have that research done yet, though. He works faster because of this little guy, I think. Putting up light near him. Not putting that dirt in. Let's see. He said... Oh! 
He's at 8 of 20 on the, uh, the little ones. Or the big ones, I mean. He was almost done with the little ones. What are you doing? Insufficient resources? Oh, sedimentary rock? No, no. Contents water. Uh, cancel. Yeah. So that should still be hooked up. I just had the wrong wrong material selected at first. That's thermally reactive. I think that means that it will transfer cold, cold or whatever. Right. So it should be cold water going in, and then it would take longer to heat up as it as it comes up here gets dispersed. We need to cool down the air, though, really badly. So I think that's going to have to be next. We'll put it in here. Uh, let's see. If we get the heavy watt wire, then we can move all of the all of the um, oxygen generation down here. So that'll be fine. Let's see. Yeah, there's a bunch of oxygen in these areas. 900. 500. And with this up at the top, it'll allow, um... It'll allow the carbon dioxide to build up down low, where this'll... This'll get some. So that'll be fine. Okay. What is that? Oh, that's one of the bugs stuck in the door. What is this? Plate? Alright, that can stay there. Okay, we got the heavy watt wire then. Um, so for that heavy watt, here it is. Carries more wattage than regular wire without overloading. Cannot be run through wall and floor tiles. Dang it. There's always a catch in there. Okay then. It can be run through ladders, though, apparently, so that's good. Okay. Power. Heavy what? Yeah, it can't be run through. Okay. Yeah. That's going to be good for all of this in here, though. That's for sure. Uh, we'll... We'll stop right there. No, we have to... We have to connect up. Yeah. Well, that... Does that work? Maybe what? Joint plate? Carries more wattage and regular wire without overloading. Can't be run through wall or floor. Higher wattage wire. Power shut off. Hydrogen generator. To electricity. Okay. So if we have if we have that water generator that creates oxygen and hydrogen out of water, and then we hook that up hook this up to that. Hundred G a second. Okay. Overheat temperatures. All right. Okay. Power transformer. This is what I need. Flowing the transformer to a thousand. Uh, connects batteries on the large side. Act as a valve and prevent wires from drawing more than a thousand. Okay. So we'll need that too. Um, let's see. Ele electricity. Yeah. Power. Wires. Deconstruct uh, this wire right there. Okay. And so for stuff like oh, stuff like these pumps, we could keep the heavy watt wire going. 
down underneath here uh, where nobody cares. But up here at the top, uh, we want the wire running through the wall because it's it's ugly. We'll move all this oxygen generation down below, so that won't be a problem. Yeah. Yeah. So I think we'll have it there. Uh, we'll go, yeah, we'll delete those, and then we'll need a uh, power transformer in here somewhere. Right, so which... Which is the big input and which is the little? Oh, I see it now. Over on the right side there. Large power transformer, energy from the left. Okay, is used by the right. Okay. So I want this ladder to be gone to... Okay. I have to take just a minute, though. I uh, have to go to the washroom. So I'll be right back. It shouldn't take very long. Okay, we're back. Let's close that. We'll get going again. All right, so for for oxygen, right? The electrolyzer converts water into oxygen and hydrogen. Becomes idle when the area reaches maximum pressure capacity. We would also want to run it through a thermoregulator. This adds to core. That's incredible. But it uh, creates a bunch of heat, right? So I don't want it to be somewhere that should remain cool. And for the electrolyzers, okay, they're pretty small. Uh, power, the hydrogen generator, is much larger. 
could fit like two of them up here. But we wouldn't have room for, for pumps is the problem. We could put like one pump up here in the corner. And then we would need a air filter also. What's the filter require? I guess I could run it up into here and then back down. Right, pump out and then uh, have the filter and run the filtered air back in. Let's see. Like, I'd really like to see information on this, though. Not the transformer, instead. Power overlay. Because I can see the power on this, but where, where's the oxygen and stuff intake? Or hydrogen, sorry, yeah. Gas intake pipe. I think it's on the top there, isn't it? Or is it on the bottom? Because that's very important. Well. I guess we'll build one and find out. Yeah, we'll have one there and one there. I don't know how many electrolyzers we would need. I'll put the gas, right? Hmm. Actually, you know what? Uh, cancel this. We're going to put them down below. Right. One there, just to see where the where the pipes go. And then we'll have the oxygen generators up top, the electrolyzers up top. Yeah. So we'll probably need at least two, right? At least? We're definitely going to need a gas pump, though, to pump it out. Have we turned off all of the electricity to everything? No. Nope. All seems to still be running, so that's good. This should definitely... Okay, yeah. It is set to be dismantled. Okay. And it's still connecting up somehow. I thought we had to have the transformer for that to work. Uh, power transformer then. Yeah. Up here is going to be better. We'll take the heavy wire... And regular wire, like that. The heavy wire is also going to come this way, though. Mm, how would we get it down into there? Oh, maybe through the door. I don't really like that it... No, it doesn't want to go through the door. The joint plate? Is that how we get it through? Probably. Okay, so you're going to come down here and hook up into there. But we want to deconstruct all of the regular wire. Is that, is it just going to replace the regular wire uh, with the new? Because I definitely want those taken down. Uh, I guess this needs to be disconnected if we're hooking up here to the 1000 watt. And then heavy wire can come around. Yeah, see, I don't like that it connects up to that. I feel like that should not be a thing. Yeah, so it has to travel through the transformer. 
Um, but what was I talking about? The the plate? Maybe what plate? Yeah, this has got to be it. Must be built in unoccupied space. How does that make any sense? So it could go through the wall, but not the not the door. Because it doesn't turn red when I do this, but it won't place either. That place is there, no problem. Let's see what happens first. This has to sit on top of something? Where? Right here? Now oh, I'm so annoyed right now. Yeah, pause. Cancel these. has to sit on top of something. Obstructed. Okay, so now we should be able to put a tile on there. Or it is a tile. I think. So now can we sit... Can we set this here? Or does it require two, two tiles to sit on? Because it feels like it's not going to sit there. What is this? Oh, copper ore that hasn't fallen down yet. I don't quite get it. It really bothers me that it has to that it has to sit on something. And there's no there's no tile blueprint there. Maybe we'll place it. No, it still says it's invalid building location. How are we supposed to get power to the side of it? saying it's invalid. I mean, if I didn't have a whole system of operations over here, I guess we could move the bottle emptier? No, we can't. Because we can't get over this because this takes up two spaces and it has to be there to avoid this. I could move it down.
This is so much more frustrating than I feel like it needs to be. Um, let's see, can we build it over here? It would have to be up. Like this. Then a couple tiles underneath, I guess. Well, we still can't... We're going to have to go up and over? Yeah, we would have to do this. Joint plate. Then the heavy watt wire can come up and in through there and the regular wire can go in here I think that's what we have to do yeah now it says it's solid it can still walk through it I think okay so that's plugged in then this isn't plugged in yet Oh yeah. Uh where's the where's the vents on these? Oh, down here of all places. That's the input down here. That's really annoying. So if this is outputting oxygen, I would have to run it up here through a a gas filter, right? And I would only want... Let's see... Uh, flip over. Yeah, so we need a gas filter here. You know what though, I think we may chain two pumps together. I wonder if that's a bad idea. I wonder if that's a bad idea. I think we're gonna do it though. So we'll get the regular gas pipe in there. Oh, sorry. We needed another gas pump. Like here maybe? Maybe here? that. Alright. So out the orange. Okay, so this is outputting all out of the green. Out of the orange, then, I would want only hydrogen. Yeah. Okay. So then... Made it that made it complicated. I shouldn't have done that. Uh, but then Yeah, how the heck? Alright. We wanted the thermoregulator. They're gonna be there. So I feel like we're definitely going to want two, two of these. Uh, electrolyzers. Jeez. Um, okay. So ventilation then for pipes. Out of the oranges going hydrogen. The green is going to be the... Uh, oxygen. So it goes there. The hydrogen. It's going to come around uh, into these machines. 
Okay. So that's going to be the hydrogen input. It's going to be outputting electricity. Second hydrogen generator, just in case. Just in case we can fill up two with two pumps and two electrolyzers. If we can't, we'll build another one right here. I don't care. But then we're going to need a gas bridge uh, this way. Yeah. So this is supposed to heat up a lot, is the problem. Which makes me wonder if we should be making these pipes out of something else. Insulated pipes. Yeah, slow heating. So we'll cancel... those and we'll go with the slow heating insulated pipes okay and then the output will also be uh, slow heating insulated pipes Perfect. And then we'll put a gas vent right there. Okay. Now for power, though, we're going to want the valve uh, to come over. We'll get the heavy watt wire to go through. And then these will output. Oh, they can't uh, can't go that way. Right there. Uh, we're out of metals, metal ore. Okay. Got some there too. well as up here, which we can't reach. Yeah, we're almost out of copper. We've got some iron over here that we could get to. So all the carbon dioxide should be pumped out uh, this vent, right? I'll probably try to run another vent uh, this direction, maybe under here. And even kind of close it off like I did with the other one. So maybe it'll flow up more than it does down, but it should be cooled. Uh, we're gonna need water too, though. So, liquid pipes. Yeah, both of these have an input. Okay, liquid bridge. Uh, around. There. And then pipe. Okay. 
Uh, I kind of want to do those last, though. Why? What? I don't know. Okay. Yeah, that seems to be working. It's putting enough power up here to power even these uh, algae oxygen diffusers and stuff. It's good. Hopefully we'll be able to like minimize our algae usage once this is all set up. Uh, but once this is all set up, we're going to have to break into here and get water out so that we have like an infinite supply, basically. I feel like another room here for another farmer would be good. Oh, it's finally cooling down. We're not getting enough... Uh... Okay. We do have enough hydrogen... Di carbon dioxide down here. We just need slime... So I need to figure out how to get the the suits disinfected. And we could start working on this too. Okay, we've got some copper. Oh yeah, 82 degrees, 85, 87, so it's a little warm still for them. We're getting gristle blossoms again, uh, storing 12 food, ouch. But they have this just laying on the ground, so they can still eat that, no problem. I didn't realize how much this was going to take, but it's really it's really going. I think we have it hooked up as well, but I could be wrong. I've been wrong before is the problem. That was so complicated. I could have put it down here if I knew I could run this over the, the pipe, but I think this wouldn't have even been able to be built on top of the carbon skimmer, which I really should get rid of, honestly. I don't think the carbon dioxide is ever going to be bad enough to fill that up, but we'll see. We're down to 32,000 kcals of food, which is terrifying. I feel like it'd be nice if we had a lot more than that. Is this still hot? No, this is this is kind of cool down here. And it's getting pushed back, too. This battery is a problem, but we'll make it work. This pipe is looks like it's very hot. 97 degrees? Even though it's got the insulation? Polluted oxygen? Gross. Why is this here? Okay. Uh, we'll just put that there. Sure.
Oh, 20 kilowatts instead of a thousand watts. Yeah, so that's cooling. Yeah, it's blowing cold air out right here. I wonder if I should have just run that vent all the way up in here. I think this light is heating things up too. There's not enough gas coming through to like chain it to another one, I don't think. Not yet, at least. Uh, priority five, all of these now. sucking out all of the gas in here so there's there's almost none left it's almost a vacuum it's still carbon dioxide but it's almost a vacuum this might be overkill with the two oh yeah and I I didn't finish the plug here there They're out of power, but these guys should should kick them on if they can never get enough uh, power going themselves. Hundred and eighteen, hundred seventeen. What's it coming out here? Eighty. Ninety. This airflow tile doesn't seem to be a lot of air through. Yeah, it's still too hot. Because it's only cooling it down by 25 degrees. Oh, man. Oh, man. It's heating up all the way up through here. Even though it's insulated pipe. 93. Insulated gas pipe. It doesn't say... Yeah, 88 degrees. 87. 88. 87. 87. So it's not getting as cool as I would like for it to be. Shoot.
I was considering running it over here and uh, taking some of the cool from the water in to the pipes before we headed up. Yeah, 90 degrees. These are still 82, 83. So somehow the temperature isn't getting transferred up the warmer temperature, but over pressure. Is that because we have two of these trying to operate at the same time? Because it didn't look like there was any gas in the in the pipe. Oh yeah, it's full now. These are barely getting any hydrogen. Are these putting up a bunch of temperature? Yeah, produces some heat. I wonder if I need to get this thing off on its own somewhere. Like over here in this corner might help. So that it's not heating up with all of these machines. I mean this is this is staying cool now. I wonder. Let's try it. Let's deconstruct this. Wait, what's... Is there anything running through there? No. Yeah, because I know that there isn't power through there. Okay. Where the heck did that come from? Oh yeah, we got some iron. We could probably even dig this out, because that's just a little bit of chlorine. I'll try it. I don't think there's any germs. I think it's too hot in this area for any germs. Igneous, some algae. So yeah, what if we chain these together, you know what I mean? Uh, insulator pipe, slow heating. It already comes over right here, which is ideal. So if we were to deconstruct these... Let's put a pause on. Okay. Go insulated tiles for igneous rocks. Go through there. And these... That one on a, on a 9. So as soon as it's visible, they'll get to it. And then we could go, uh, yeah, thermal regulator in this big old room on its own. Uh, of course, the inputs and outputs are backwards again. That's okay, though, because we can put the... We can put these through the ground. So, 
insulator pipe. There. Pumps are stopped up now. Uh, we'll need one of these guys. Right there. And a heavy watt wire. There. Oh yeah, this is all on a six here. Almost there. Okay, it's pumping again. 90 degrees in here only, so far. Pipe blocked. Come on. By what? Oh. Uh, insulator pipe. This guy. Why did it, uh, take that away? I don't know. Yeah, that's at a six, though. Hurry. Hurry, do it. Hurry. We may also need a high pressure gas vent, refined metal and plastic, if that's not handling it. Or I could do, like I said, and run one way over here, uh, an output like down here or something, or maybe even this far. But also this means that I'm going to have to ladder over to get to this, because it's unreachable here. Gas vent there. Would it be cheaper to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, or 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 7. There. I'll be able to reach it from there. I don't even have to take this ladder down. I can just leave it. Hundred degrees, ninety-four. So it's slightly cooler in here. I wonder if I can create a vacuum in here. Uh, that would stay much cooler all the time. There. Now it's working. Cooling 110, 111, 110. Oh yeah. It has to have an output before it'll actually uh, work though. So this is the only one that's able to output right now. I feel like it's producing a ton more oxygen. I guess H2O, right? 
It should be hydrogen 2, oxygen 1. But this looks like it's the opposite. Like, I think we could easily just disable this and let all of the hydrogen go into this. coming out. There we go. 80. Oh yeah, all this meal lice is growing now. Oh good. We might be back on top of it. I think meal lice only is produced by this thing, sadly. So really what I want are the mushrooms, but we need slime for that. And we need, um, we need suits to get slime, because I don't want everybody to be slime-lunged all the time. Uh, did they... No, they haven't crafted this yet. They'll get there tomorrow, maybe. What the heck? My finger's in the wrong place? No. What's happening? Okay, for some reason I was pressing S and it was taking away the, the HUD. That was strange. I've tabbed out for a second to check the check the chat to make sure that nobody had been talking while I was uh, busy. Make sure that my phone was updating properly, it is. And the glossy boy, he loves... He loves living in here, right? Excretes phosphorite. Is he eating bristle blossoms? What is he eating in here? And how old is he? 65 of 150. We need to get him uh, wrangled one of these days, though, soon. So that we can shear his scales and get the, uh, get the plastic. Three eighty-four, eighty-five. Still better than one hundred and one, though. Ninety, ninety-one, and now it's overloaded too already. Oh, it's a little pipe. Oh no, it can't be over pressure because there's not enough. There's not enough gas coming through. There's a ton of oxygen in here, though, sadly. I thought there would be a lot more hydrogen, though. It's pretty sad. Pretty sad. I was thinking about putting another one of these in, but if it's not going to produce more hydrogen, then that... It's not really worth it. 94. So this should be cooling down over here now a little bit. It'll probably take it a long time to cool and then rise up. Still going up a little bit. Well, 94. I guess that's about right. No power. Yeah, I was hoping we could get one of these, like, really running, but it doesn't seem to be the case. And I don't know how else we could produce hydrogen. You know what I mean? Uh, refinement, no. 
That's ethanol, fertilizer, algae. Yeah, none of that helps. None of that helps. Rust and oxygen and chlorine. Filter carbon dioxide. Gas reservoir. Huh. Achievement unlocked. Oxygen not included. Distribute a thousand kilograms of oxygen using gas vents. Beautiful. We did it. Hundred and forty degrees in here? Are you kidding me? Insulated pipe though is eighty four. Still, atmosphere is insufficient for this one. Atmosphere and pressure? What's the pressure at? 900? Yeah, it's 150 to 10,000. Why does it keep saying that uh, pressure is a problem? I thought it was 1,000. Current gas pressure is zero? It's not though, it's 900. I guess it means zero of carbon dioxide. How could I get carbon dioxide in here though? Everything we have is to scrub carbon dioxide out, isn't it? Like this, I guess, produces carbon dioxide and heat. Just take that one apart. If we don't have the power to run it, it doesn't make sense for it to be in here. Yeah, it is hot in here. It's 146, 148. Get out of there, buddy. Go cool off somewhere. Yeah, it's still saying that the that the vents overloaded. I guess we could try to output more, but it seems wild to me that they would even need that. We have more iron ore. I think we'll use iron for this one. Oh, we're running kind of low on cold now, too. 3,000. This guy's not getting loaded up like I would like for him to. So we're running out of power all over the place. What were we running on these again? Five. 
So I might be able to... No, because these, right? That's only 800. I've got this ton of stuff. Runs to this battery, which is half full. This light. Hmm. I'm not sure. Not sure what we need to be doing there. Hmm. I'm trying to think too how I want to do the the chlorine thing. Maybe I'm overthinking it and I could just put a pump in there or something to equalize the pressure. I don't know. Figure out a way to do it that way. So I don't love it that they keep opening these up to come up here, especially for like storage and stuff. I feel like we could do better than that. But we need slime so we can get mushrooms going because I'm tired of not having enough food. Yeah, that's being loaded up, but we're going to run out of coal soon. There's coal here. But that's not a lot, you know. Not a lot to rely on. Uh, what else do we have as far as coal and stuff? Igneous rocks. We did dig way back here. Igneous, granite, phosphorite. Yeah, iron, algae. There's more coal right around there. But that's all chlorine and stuff too. This is a ton of iron ore up here. Now really, if we close this off, we could have them run in here and do all the stuff. I get all this coal and we would have access to the iron ore and all that. And these seeds and stuff, right? Okay, so let's take a look then at the um at the things stations. Atmos suit dock. Checkpoint. Oh, we, we still need textiles, right? We still need the dang plants before we can even uh, make make suits. I guess we throw this down and see what it requires, right? How much electricity does it take? Two forty. Jeez. Well, we, it won't be running all the time, though. Put it there. Exosuit Forge. This also requires 240. And overheats. Hang on. Okay, this doesn't doesn't seem to overheat. Uh, where was the Exosuit Forge then? Uh, stations. Tell me it'll fit here. It doesn't. It's just too wide. It would fit in here. Four. So we could put it here. That'll be fine. We'll do uh, regular tiles, maybe? Yeah. Deconstruct those. I don't think we even really need uh, a door there. kind of surprising. I thought that it, it would pull 
gas from over here too, but I guess it's just overloaded. So maybe we did need two in there. I feel like it's excessive. Oh, maybe the water wasn't flowing or something because of low power. Those temps, though. It's heating up over here. It's not cooling down. This seems cooler. This is very cool. Yeah, 86 coming out. So none of the plants are stifled anymore. That's wonderful. This doesn't have any uh, fertilizer for it. There's some up here, but we just haven't gotten to it yet. Okay, we're getting there, we're getting there. Uh, so what is what does this need? No workable order. So we don't even have what we need to run this. That's wonderful. I always like to, to find that out. Uh, what if we were to find... Where is it? Like textiles? Come on. Morale, maybe? Sound amplifiers, renewable energy. Micro target medicines, we already did sanitation, caffeination. Uh, decor. I don't see clothes over here. Transit tubes, that sounds like fun. Glass blowing. Fine art would be good to get. I don't know what the size of these portraits are. These actual portrait canvases. Let's see. Computing. Yeah, we got rocketry down there. That's not going to be it. I don't. I just don't see clothes anywhere. I figured since we already had that sweater, we would know how to make sweaters. Food repurposing. Provides refreshment on their breaks. Drinking juice. Increases morale. Okay. Critter trap, fish trap, incubator, critter sensor. Gourmet meal. Petroleum? Okay, we haven't even found that yet. Fossil fuels, oil refinery, natural gas. Smart battery. Jukebox, power control. Uh, we learned that wasn't already. Let's turn this off now. I don't, I don't see clothes anywhere. Temperature modulation is there, but there's no, like, hot or cold weather clothes. Hazard protection, transit tubes, jetpacks, no other clothes here. This is all smart stuff, and then rockets. There's not going to be clothes in here. Yeah, because this is where, maybe it... Uh, won't show me anything until we have fabrics. Yeah, because this is the loom. So I assume this is to make, like, fabrics out of? Let's run that in. Oh, I'm getting tired, folks. I'm getting tired. I've been going a lot longer than I normally do. By about half, I guess. Only an hour and a half longer than normal. All of this should be cooling down real good. Uh, we just need the carbon dioxide and the... Yeah. And the slime for them. I keep saying that I know that's what we need. But I need to find a way to get over there is the problem. Where did we have polluted water on the ground? 
Anybody? Somebody do a duty? I don't see any problems here. We probably should also break this open. 104 degrees now, 95 still. This is outputting a lot of temperature, a lot of heat. Maybe if I insulated all of this tile, it would stay cooler. Yeah, because 88, I think that is the problem. Igneous rock. Oh no. Hang on. Cancel that one. Well, actually, don't. Don't cancel that one. Just don't build on this one. Uh, or this one. I don't think we can reach that one. Okay, maybe we can. Fine, I'm not gonna argue. Oh yeah. Temps are looking great in the farms. That's what we need. Even if it is just lice loaf or whatever. Is there only supposed to be two in here? Four? I guess that's okay. We've had a new dupe available for a long time, but I just haven't haven't done it. And I wonder what the impact of this is. Like, should I change this back to... to temperate stuff so that the temperature change down here will transfer up through there? Maybe. Maybe. We have so many skill points, but I just can't upgrade right now because we're not in a position to do that. five degrees <laughs> from from heating copper we could get some iron ore going because we do have a bit of that we'll do a little of each so we have options as well vital cells everybody doing morale 12 of 9 9 of 10 Rowan is uh, is low on morale Abe is on par this bit is 7 of 4. Oh, I'm reading it wrong. We got 12 of 9. Total morale is 12. He only needs 9. So the left one being high is what we want. So everybody's good except for Rowan. Yeah. I was reading it correct then. I thought it was Joshua that I needed to look at for some reason. Rowan, buddy. What's your problem? Washroom 2, Duplicate 1, 2, Shift Break 1, Barracks 1, Last Cycles Decor Ugly, Skills Learn 10. Okay. Uh, we're going to need to learn about art so we can dress up his room. I see you would think. Plastic comfy bed. Okay. They'll probably like that. I think it's quite a lot bigger than the... Single plant? Sun lamp? Beach chair? Oh my gosh. New media? Alright. We'll try to get far, fine art at least. Foreign art? Ah, here's another glossy one down here. How old are you? 28? 148 of 150. He's about done. Wild Draco. We need to get some of these guys. Okay. It's it's way past time that I actually got uh, Atmo suits going, but... Yeah.
hungry. I don't think... Yeah. I think I mentioned that we don't have any place to put polluted dirt. I guess we could put slime in there too for now. Because it'll be used on the... The, uh, things anyway. So we could also put the ladder down behind. I don't know. Can they reach ladders at this level? Might have to put some here. And then they could jump across. I don't know. Maybe we just wait and see. I could always move this towards the back, but I kind of like that they could fill it up from the outside. And now I kind of want to know how to get polluted dirt. There was a way. Oh, we could build out the uh, apothecary up here. Triage cot, sick bay. That's got to be better than the triage, right? Accelerates health, restoration, and the healing of physical injuries. Revives incapacitated duplicates. Minister basic treatments. Oh yeah, this is just a straight up increase of health. Out of granite? I guess that does increase decor and we have a whole bunch of it. So yeah, we'll do it out of granite. Maybe here. I think we need a mess... A mess table and a... Um, yeah. Toilet and a mess table. Okay. I think that's a plumbed toilet as well. Which seems excessive to me, but we can do it. Now it just says... Why does it say toilet and not lavatory? I don't know. The mess table is small, though. And no sink that we need? Because it would seem like we would want a sink in here. No. Yeah, toilet and mess table. put it here we could also have a sink there though so when they leave this direction they can always use uh, the sink put that there we'll put a sink oh medical we'll put a sink here or we could do hand sanitizer yeah what do we oh what do we need for that metal ore and bleach stone we don't have bleach stone Okay, we'll do the sink then, because it'll be alright. Then, plumbing, we could go with pipes. This is clean water here. Goes in the bottom, right? I'm pretty sure. I'm sure that's how we've got it plumbed, yeah. Okay. And then, uh, and then what do we want to do? We could bring the polluted water around this way. And then over and down, I think we will. Okay. And then this is polluted water coming down. So all we have to do is come over here and do a liquid bridge that's going to be uh, in and out like this. Yeah. There. So then the hospital has, has a dang toilet in it. Bleach stone. We'll find that eventually, I think. What did I make this pipe out of? The stuff that doesn't heat? I guess that's okay. We don't have... We don't have that much of it, though. 
Oh, we researched. Fine art is complete. So let's see what that uh, does for us. Would that be under base? No, it's... It can't be utilities. Furniture. Duh. Furniture. Okay, blink. Canvas. Oh, it requires fiber, too. Sculpting block. Yeah, decor plus 20% for the granite. And these are one by three, which is pretty insane. Uh, Rowan needs it in his room, though. Is this? This is his room, I think. I don't like the shape of it. How about this sculpting rock? Is it shorter? It is. So what if we did a sculpting rock here? Uh, flower pot. Also made out of granite. There. And we'll see how that goes. This is Rowan's bed? Yeah. So we need to give him some more morale. What was I building down here? Oh yeah. Exosuit forge. Yeah, Atmos suit. Aluminum, copper, iron. And a worn one. Okay, so we'll throw some heavy watts on here. Oh, we can't go through the the things. There. Okay. Oh, here's bleach stone right here. If we dug this out, we could get a... Uh, maybe we could get enough for the thing. I don't know, though. Okay. What do we want? Briar's mirth leaf? That's got to be the good stuff, right? Atmosphere, everything. This plant improves ambient decor. This plant improves decor. We'll try this. We only have three seeds, but we'll try it. Rowan, this is for you, buddy. No, no, no. Don't, uh, don't do that. Move over here. Um. Skill required operation. Minorly increases decor, contributing to morale. Must be sculpted by a duplicate. Who was my... Who was my... Decorator? Oh, he is. Rowan is my decorator. I'm sorry, buddy. I totally forgot. Yeah, he's a level 2 already. Nice. Oh, it wilted right away. <laughs> now it's back. Okay. Oh, yeah. It's much better in here. A banana? He sculpted a banana. But it, it is, it's much better in there. This light is helping. There was a, a bug in here. But he's gone. Yeah, everywhere they go, there's good decor. So it's good that there's two in here. I kind of wish one of them would spend more time over here, but I can't tell them where to be. Unless I made the room smaller. And that wouldn't quite work for what I'm trying to do. Eighty-five up here, eighty-eight. So these, I'm surprised these aren't a little stifled, but it's okay. We're finally building back up our calorie count, so that's good. Loopy lugs, hey, how's it going? Lurk while you're working, man. I appreciate it, dude. Thank you so much for coming by. Yeah, just trying to build a little colony here. This is my first try at the game, so it's been it's been an experience so far. <laughs> uh yeah, so I think we have more iron than we do anything else. 300 kilograms reed fibers, 2 units. Okay. So we do need we need the reeds. We can get them up here. Oh. 
Oof. We could get them under here, too. If we go underneath the slime and around, and underneath the polluted water, too. Uh, okay. And I think the steam is killing uh, all the germs from everything else. All right, so if we want... If we want these, we have to... We have to try to dig in here, I think. So we'll do that. We'll get this slime. And that'll bring uh, that seed down. That sandstone, slime, and water. A thimble reed. Try to uproot it. 120 degrees, so it's going to be hot when they try to get in here. Germ overlay. So, you know what though? Let's not do this one first. Let's get this one first. Let's dig one below there. Uh, we'll get this copper. And then, yeah, one below there. Like that. Okay. It's working. And then we'll build a ladder up. Yeah, like this. Then we'll uproot. A buddy bud, uproot, dust cap, and dust cap. We'll get all of them. Then we'll be able to plant more mushrooms. It'll be great. I think this guy was about to die, wasn't he? No. He's still only half half his own age. So I'm not exactly sure how chlorine behaves is the problem. Otherwise, I would try to dig up in here and then take care of the man. Shell balmy lily. Because if we did the ladder like there, and then put a put an airlock there, do a dig like that. What do they eat again? Drecklet eggs? No, that's what they like. Mealwood, bristle blossom. Yeah. And none of that is in here. None of that can grow in here. But he has to live in, uh... In here, right? Oh, his scales only grow in hydrogen. I see. And every three cycles we could, uh, share him... So there's a batch of hydrogen, but hydrogen likes to go up. I know that for sure. So like this over here, if we came in underneath and then dropped him in here, he would be able to float around. There's a bunch of coal in here, too. Hmm. Rough. If we went in behind the smelter and then did a ladder up, we could put him in here. We could even make this like a nature reserve or something and still have the grooming and shearing stations in here. Let's see. Mealwood. Will you pollute oxygen, carbon dioxide, and oxygen? So it won't grow in here because that's all chlorine and hydrogen. It would need some oxygen to live in. I guess if we close this up, there's a little oxygen here. We could have plants and, like, uh, dig one of these out. Pressure is 2,000 in there, and it's only 1,000 here. So some of the oxygen would stay. And then it would have something to eat. I don't know. 
We could also pump some of this oxygen like straight into here to make sure that there is some. I don't know. We'll have to think about it because this guy needs uh, needs hydrogen too, right there. And um, we could get plastic from him without having to find petroleum. Which I don't know about you guys, but that seems uh, pretty fair to me. Yeah, see, it, it seems to be floating above the carbon dioxide, but I saw it hovering like underneath the oxygen. Over pressure again, but I really don't think... Yeah, the pipes aren't full is not what it means. What was I doing again? Oh yeah, we're trying to get uh, thimble reed. And it wants, okay, it'll grow in oxygen, 71 to 98 degrees, and it's fine. So we should be able to plant that right away. Maybe take a few of these and replace them. We'd only be able to start one at a time, but once we break this open, it'll all be game over then. Here, let's build a, a tile uh, right here so the water doesn't keep seeping in here. We'll mop this up after we dig a little bit further in, and then we'll um, we'll seal this off before we open this up, because we shouldn't need to come back in here, I don't think. Yeah, igneous rock granite. There's a little coal around this, but that's not what we're here for. There's a bit of slime, too. Is that three? Oh, it's four. So we can't quite reach that unless I build up. But that's okay. 136, 138. I think it's going to singe them uh, once it starts pouring down. And also... Man, I just thought we could dig here, uh, deconstruct that, build a tile further in. Because they can, I think they can crawl through there. And then we could open it up on this side of the ladder so that we still can climb up and get in here. I don't know if this will just fill up with water and then flow down on both sides or how it's going to behave. I have no idea. We'll find out though. Get this stuff swept eventually. I think it's sandstone, and I think we definitely have a lot of sandstone. Yeah, they should be able to jump across and then get in here. That slime had germs on it, right? Yeah, so I don't really want to get onto that. I would kind of like this gold amalgam, though. And there's some up there, too. Oh, I shouldn't be doing that. I'm going to get in trouble. I set this to be deconstructed several times, didn't I? Yeah. Now we're running out of coal really fast. I should have given these guys more stuff to eat. Uh, what do we have the most of then? We're up on meal ice. Um, buildable, buildable materials. We've got a bunch of clay. I feel like that's useful later though. We don't have much iron. I thought we had a lot more than that. Mm, eggshells. Let's 
Oh. Yeah, the tea always throws me off, so granite we have the most of. Okay. So in here, uh, put, put granite. Compostable, consumable, metal. Raw mineral. Granite. There we go. Yeah, and we'll put this at like a, at like an eight. Oh no, he's out. I don't have any place to put him yet, though. We have access to all these, though. Balm lily and stuff. Yeah, chlorine they want to live in. Mirth leaf. This is all coal as well. Yeah, so we'll try to get in here and take all of this, even if it is chlorine. Pinch of pepper plant. Do these require chlorine too? Only? Uh, fertilized with phosphorite, irrigated with polluted water. I see. Produce flavorful pinch of pepper nut for spicing food. Okay. Oh wow, that filled up fast. Okay, we'll put it back down to a five and uh, dump. Dump that granite. It said they were hungry, so I imagine they will they will dig into this. Cause they eat everything, don't they? Yeah. I'm sure granite is in there. Crushed rock, I didn't think about that. Granite is not in there. Of all the things to not have in there. Frost burger, sushi, crushed rock. I wonder if we could uh, crush granite in a uh, rock crusher. Dang it. I'll bet it requires power too. Let's see. Station? It can't be a station, right? It's not. Refinement. There we go. Rock crusher. No, oh, it's huge. Why is it so big? She said. <laughs> uh. We could put it here. Oh, it's a bit questionable, but it's possible. And then we could run a heavy wire down here. We're already using too much power, though. We need another coal generator down here, and we need a better power production. Yeah, there's slime, slime lung on these. Ah, this is probably a terrible idea, but crushed stone will probably work. I don't know if we can crush granite though. If we can't, we can crush sandstone probably. Oh yeah, lice loafs uh, for life now. At least for a little while. For life for a little while. Man. They just won't do this. I guess, um, my digger has too many other jobs, though. Yeah. He's working the farm pretty hard right now. Who are my designated... Eric Travaldo? Yeah, he's got the super-duper hard uh, digging. Diamond and obsidian. So, Abyssalite, he can get, uh, let's see, Joshua can do? Yeah. Because he just came with super hard dick.
muck root. Okay. I guess they're eating those like potatoes. I guess that's basically what they are. Eggshell to lime, granite to sand, to sand, so we can't make crushed rock. Will they eat sand? Clay, sedimentary rock, sand, very first thing. Yeah. Okay. All right, then. We'll do, um... I went way past it. We'll do, uh... Granite to sand. It's 100 per. Here. Would I just do, like, uh, 99? Yeah. That'll do. To sand, though. I don't like that, because I don't want to fill this up with sand and then not have any for my deodorizers. we got to try it, though. Raw. Uh, it's not refined metal. It's, um, I know what it is. Filtration. Yeah, sand. And we'll put it back up to a 7. Get people to load it up. It's so funny to me that they just leave their lice loaves laying around. It's kind of weird. Alright. No, the ladders are all in a six anyway. Let's get that going, please. I know it's abyssalite, but come on, guys. We just need to dig into it. Pardon me. Yeah, I can tell the water level is dropping a little bit. Not much, but enough to be noticeable. Oh, these these are done. Let's do uh, set direction left. So they're always washing hands when they leave. This needs doctor station medical supplies. Crucial materials for this building are beyond reach or unavailable. What? Uh, where was the doctor stuff? Here. Pathogen diagnostics, germ sensor, disease clinic, hot tub, requires pipes to and from tub and power to run the jets. Water must be a comfortable temperature and will cool rapidly. That's actually good. Robotic tools, huh? Artificial friends? A sweepy bot to sweep up solid debris and liquid spills. Dock stores liquids and solids gathered by the sweepy. Uses power to recharge the sweepy. Amazing. That's actually really good. Oh, smart storage and stuff all looks like a lot of fun. Man, I cannot wait to get into all of this. I'm so excited. Connects building to power sources. Large power transformer. Connects batteries on the large side to act as a valve. Four kilowatts. Because that's what this runs, right? Four kilowatts. Heavy watt conductive wire. No, oh, no. Steam turbine. So we could probably uh, put this right above the steam vent, right? The cool steam, maybe? And what did we find down here? What was this? 
volcano thing? Saltwater geyser. That's right. How hot is it down here? 159 degrees. That's got to be putting off some steam, right? You would think? Oh, that poor morb is about to die. Poor little, poor little morb. Man, there's just too much farming to do. He's not getting out here to dig the abyssalite. Nobody is. Hopped eardrum. Oh yeah, they filled it up. No more sand. Oh yeah, there we go. Hydrogen runs out so fast on these things. It's coming out 92, 95 degrees. It's still only 80 up here though. 97. Oh, yeah, it's really hot down in here. I wonder if this is a culprit. Heat production, yeah. 1000 DTUs. So this is just like barely keeping this at bay. This is still necessary, and this, for keeping these at a reasonable temperature. Yeah, that's even barely, barely growable. Even with this uh, metal tile for the cool to pass through. I guess heat rises though, so the cool is just kind of sitting around down here. This should be up here, but then I wouldn't have room for the farm station. So there's that. Did they ever get this done? Man. What the heck? What the heck, guys? Here. Too much liquid? Yeah, we need it spread out still. Hopefully somebody will get to it today. Yeah. I kind of need to end the stream because I'm getting really tired. It's quite late. It's about time for me to hit the hay, so... Got five curative tablets and 40 allergy medications. I can't believe we had that many allergy medications. I had no idea. Hydroponic farm. Oh, I told it to grow, um... Yeah, don't grow that. Balm lily? I don't think it'll grow there. There, thimble reed seed. Uh, plant. Okay. Irrigation. Is he irrigated in polluted water? He is. You jerk. Ah. Heck. Okay, that's all. Load. You jerk. How could we even pull that off? Because, I mean... This is the only place that we're pumping... Oh, man. Okay. 
here's what we do then. Oh, man. Why has it got to be so complicated? See the way you're acting like you're somebody else gets me frustrated? Life's like this. Can they... They've got to be able to build through those walls, right? I would think so. There. Let's come over here. Uh, we'll come up this way. We got four. And then that corner should be fine. Okay. Uh, what about this guy? Will he live in... He doesn't care. He doesn't even need to be irrigated. Okay, that's good to know. Uh, then plumbing, pipe, deconstruct. Like, what do we want? Two or three, like three or four or five mushrooms, and then like four, four of these plants. We'll try that. Oh, they did a little more digging over here. I think we'll bump this up. All that to dig one? <laughs> okay, he's got to get a breath. Oh no, he left! Dang it. Dang it, Joshua. Are we out of coal? We are. So all of these lower machines are, are toast. Where'd this guy go? Oh, there he is. Okay. Yeah, and that chlorine is just kind of hanging out right there, which is nice. Uh, let's do a dig. Let's see, they can climb. They can come down here, climb up here, and climb up here. So they can get all of that and this. Oh yeah, that algae too. These. Yep. You guys are gonna be nice and clean though. No more germs. Major skin irritation, I think it said. go get food do their duties and go to sleep wow another cycle oh man well i was hoping to get into the steam vent and all that tonight but i don't think it's going to happen i also need to work on trying to fix my power problem obviously coal is one option and so we're going to dig out a bunch of this and get all of that coal uh where else is there a nice chunk of coal We've got iron and stuff over here. Here's a nice chunk of coal in, in this little area here. I think it would be easier to, like, dig across than it would be to come down, because I want to open this up uh, next time, definitely. And this is pretty easy stuff. We could get some bleach stone from here, too. Just dig across and start getting in here. The only problem is the chlorine gas, right? So... I really do need to get the suits set up so that we can uh, navigate this stuff without so much problem. Yeah, 
Yeah, come on, Joshua. You can do it. We'll get this other thimble uh, weed in no time. He's the only one that can dig the abyssalite for this ladder, too, though. Well, no, he's not. Uh, there's one other one other person who can do it. Let's see. Did they put... Yeah, they put the coal straight in. There's a huge chunk of coal, too, down here. So if we just came over with the ladder and just came straight down here, through all of this abyssalite, no less. Yeah, there's some slime, slime lung and stuff there, too. So we'd have to dig this one out. And then go for a ladder uh, straight down. Yeah. So all of that's going to have to be Joshua's doing as well. Sand. Have they eaten all the sand yet? Nope. There's still sand there. They're elderly. Yeah. So they're getting ready to die. We never put any um, any eggs in there. Sedimentary rock and dirt. I guess we could have tried dirt, but I don't know. Yeah, they haven't deconstructed these yet for us to put the other pipes in. Oh, I think he's... I think he's taking sand away from here, which is not what I want him to be doing. Yeah. There's still 17T there of sand. Okay. Oh, uh, why don't you... Why don't you go do something else? Store millwood seed? Okay. Very high priority. Fine. Mealwood seed it is. Store sand? Why is he doing this? Okay. Store granite? Store water. There you go. Yeah, so he's just tidying up right now. He's my builder, though, right? I figured that he would be deconstructing, but I guess builders don't do that. I don't know. Relaxing at the water cooler. Hardly anybody comes over here and hangs out at this thing. There he is. Old Abe. He's fine with it. Wait, is it cold in here? No. And it's kind of hot over here still. really cooling down in here though maybe soon we could try to get rid of this one so that we can uh... well no I think this one is what's cooling all of this down right because the cold air goes down so I think this one being here is only cooling like this small area right here I don't think this one's very effective actually so maybe I should get rid of this one Either close this up or uh, run the gas on down. Let's see what happens if we try that. Yeah, igneous rock. Right, on over and then. Oh, I didn't. I didn't go far enough. Mm, we only have slightly more iron. Copper. Oh yeah, we had power for a second. It's fine though. I guess we have to uh, priority up these. So Joshua will get over there and do them. All right, but seriously, I do have to go. Uh, we'll have to pick this back up next time. We're about to a point where maybe we need another dupe to get the jobs done, but I worry because uh, we've only just now started to rebuild our calorie count, and I'm about to remove some of the, the food items. Granted, it's so that we can get other food items in here, so, you know, hopefully it'll be helpful. 
because if we can get some mushrooms growing, we can have cooked mushrooms, and those are really good meals. Fried mushrooms? Yeah, plus one. Barbecue, I think, is the only one that's much better. Minus one, plus one, plus one, plus two for omelets. But we don't have any, like, reliable egg, uh, egg givers besides the shine bugs. But when I allowed those, uh, we were killing all of them. Like, right now, we might have too many coming up. But they add so much to the decor, I feel like they're almost necessary. So, we'll see. Because yeah, we don't have our limit in here yet. Right, there's supposed to be at least two. And there's only one. There's two here. It looks like there's four in here and an egg. And then there's three eggs in here or so. But they only last for 25 days anyway. These guys are about to die. Yeah. Age 99 of 100. 96 of 100. I don't think they ever laid any eggs. Which is wild. Maybe they... Maybe there was an egg back here at one point, but I don't know. Man. Okay. I've got to go. I really do. I need to get out of here because uh, I'm getting stuck. Because I want to keep playing so bad. But I got to get moving. He's almost through. And then we'll have another thimble reed thing. But we still can't plant it anywhere because, yeah, he wants, uh, he wants polluted water. Which we are trying to run through. We'll get it. That's going to do it for this uh, stream then. Thank you everybody who showed up. I really appreciate it. It means a lot all the time. And yeah, if you want to catch another one, be sure to subscribe. Consider supporting my channel by becoming a member or through the Patreon link down in the video description. And feel free to check out any of my other videos or playlists that you might be interested in. I thank you so much for all the time that you spend on my channel. And I hope blessings of wisdom and peace on all of you. Farewell.